Hello! What's up, guys? <laughs> hi, Aiden. Hi, Squid. Um, so yeah, the plan tonight is I'm only going to do, like, two Ascension quests, probably. You vote Gondor, Miyabi. I, um... Wait, what is it playing right now? This is not my playlist. No. Oh, Celeste OST, I love you, but, like, where did my playlist go? <laughs> okay, YouTube playlist just completely broke. Okay, good to know. Great. I don't know why YouTube playlists sometimes do that. They just start playing music that's just not in the playlist. And I'm trying to, like, have a little chill time now. This is Celeste. Well, it was Celeste. You changed your answer. Oh, do you just want me to do the best two? Because I don't know if we should have the best two back to back. Poggin like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if that's a great idea. Nabi Abi is one of the best. Gotta do Ashira though. Well, you're, you're suggesting all good ones. We gotta do the stinkers at some point, Ollie. I was thinking about doing Riku Manana. How does that make you feel? I mean, I could do a Shira. Actually, I don't think I can do a Shira because I don't have her. I don't have her thing up, like her Kony up, level up enough. Actually, I don't think I need her level up. I was doing some research. I think all I have to do is Noah's side story and then hers up. Uh, uh, what was that? Why is it also so loud? What is going on? Why is everything so loud right now? Whoever that was. Who was that? A bagel? <laughs> did you already do all the Ouroboros ones? I did. Also, hello, the final mask. I, I, um, those are the only ones I have up on my YouTube channel right now. I'm editing, um, some right now, and we're trying to finish. So here, I'm just going to read through every single one that I have not done. Okay, ready? Here we go. I'm, I have a list. Okay. I have not done the ones I will list. Riku Manana. Fiona. Alexandria. Monica. Gondor. Ashira. Miyabi. Sagiri. Queens. So it's about half, the, half of them left. About half of them. I think. Around that. I think. You done, you know, I don't have the DLC, so I, uh, I don't, I'm not gonna, as of right, as, as of specifically right now, I don't have plans to make a video on, you know, I will do it at some point, because I'm gonna get the DLC eventually. The DLC is not worth the money, well, here's my theory, I want to see if they do something like what they did with Torna, where they, um, they release a physical version with like a, a a code in it for the rest of the dlc stuff so i want to see if that'll actually happen and if it doesn't then i'll just buy the dlc but until that happens i'm a huge like game collector kind of guy so i don't want to do that would probably be better for you know and the other hero for you oh you're right i forgot they're coming out with another hero you're right guys look what Check out what came in the mail today. <laughs> you ready for this? Ah! <laughs> the creature. <laughs> a dubious little creature getting up to mischief. I love this. This is actually such a cool amiibo. I didn't think it'd be that cool because it's like, it's just a little dude. Like, the orbs are, like, all glowy, and the ink splash is, like, actually cool. I wish he had the Family Guy haircut. Nintendo, why didn't you let us customize? But this is still dope. And I think Nintendo stopped putting, uh, like, tinfoil on the bottom to block NFC signals. So I think I can just scan him and leave him in the box like this. <laughs> I think. Who knows? We'll try it. My little man. Scan him into the matrix. Okay, I'll try it. <laughs> He's gonna break out of the box with only his stomach. Yeah, his insatiable appetite will consume everything. 
Okay. So I'm thinking, if you guys are cool, I'm, on, I'm only going to do two tonight. Because I started kind of late, and I, I want to finish so I can edit a different Ascension quest so I can post it on the YouTube channel on Friday. <laughs> on Friday, I want to post a separate Ascension quest on the channel. And to do that, I gotta, I can't do three Ascension quests tonight. So I'm gonna, I'm thinking Riku Manana Miyabi. What do you guys think of that plan? Any objections? I really like Miyabi. Miyabi is such a, Miyabi feels like a main party character. Can I be honest? <laughs> I don't know why I have to ask you guys to be honest about that, but Miyabi feels like if there was another main party member, it'd be her. Because she just, like, fits really well. I like Miyabi a lot. I also... <laughs> speaking of Miyabi and Riku and Manana, I love Manana's voice actor. Or is a character, eh. It's like, I mean, what can they really do? It's a pretty minor main party main, uh, member, uh, party member. But I love her voice actor. Rumbly grumbly. Her tummy gets a rumbly grumbly. Okay, so. So guys, I told you about my plan last stream. I My goal is to have this entire playthrough and my entire Splatoon playthrough, which is, I just posted Area 6 of the Splatoon playthrough today if you're interested. My goal is to have the entire Splatoon playthrough and the entire Xenoblade playthrough done by the end of the year. Which means... I listed off like 10 ascension quests I still have to do. I have to like, if I'm doing all separate videos, I'm gonna have to post a video like every other day, <laughs> which I can do it. This song is going crazy. It's a little loud though. I'm gonna have to post a video like every other day, which I'm gonna do it because the videos are only gonna be like 15, 20 minutes ish long. I think I can do it. That's my goal. And I, I, I think, I think we, it can happen. Do you see the trailer with Mithra's voice actor saying fuck? I did. <laughs> it was really funny. Man, what? It, she said, she's talking about zombies or whatever, right? <laughs> Wait, Manana's voice actor was in 13 Reasons Why? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I don't remember that. Okay. Okay, pause this. <laughs> boom, boom. Give me one sec. <laughs> We're gonna watch this. We're gonna watch this together. <laughs> Friggin' zombies! These reanimated fuckers come in all <laughs> shapes and sizes. <laughs> Friggin' zombies! These reanimated fuckers come in all shapes and sizes. Didn't, didn't like, didn't Blunzy like quote retweet, retweet this? With something that like, like uh, like an edit of this, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to Blunzy's account because <laughs> I think he I think he quote retweeted this. I love this tweet. This is <laughs> Xenoblade cutscenes are so good. Xenoblade cutscenes. <laughs> 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 okay, I got. I, 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 scroll down. Oh yeah, here it is. Here it is. <laughs> Friggin' zombies! These reanimated fuckers come in all shapes and sizes. <laughs> We've all dreamt about smashing zombie brains, right? <laughs> yeah, we have. We have. That's what I'm saying. That is exactly what I've been saying. Ooh. <laughs> it's literally Mithra. <laughs> Dangerous game to go on Blunzy's account live on Twitch. Oh, you're right. <laughs> I see that meme on Twitter sometimes. It's like, don't ask Xenoblade fans what Blunzy put on their Twitter timeline three days ago. Because <laughs> some very occasionally Blunzy will just retweet porn. And I'm like, bro. <laughs> I love your tweets. We gotta tone it down on this. We can't be doing this right now.
Yeah, he would reply to it, yeah. That's what it was. Guys! Dino Blade! Woohoo! So the um I'm gonna I'm gonna do Riku Manana first, and then we're gonna go to um Miami after that. You turned off retweets on his account. I love his account. His account is genuinely fantastic in my opinion. For the content. Every once in a while it'll drop a stink bomb on my timeline. <laughs> But I'm a fan. I really do like the funny things that he posts. <laughs> like, I'm just trying to find something right now. It's, he has a lot of art. Which I love. That's why I follow him, because art's cool too. But every once in a while, he'll just make an unhinged post. Like, wasn't he the one, Ollie, that made the post that's like, I want Mio to bite into my neck, slowly killing me instantly. <laughs> I want Nia to sink her- or no, not Nia. I want Mio to sink her kitty fangs into my neck, slowly killing me instantly. <laughs> and I'm like, you know what, me too. Sh slowly but surely killing me instantly, yeah. <laughs> I like how the, uh, <laughs> the hi-hat in this theme goes hard. Hold up, let him cook. I'm letting him cook. It is. I, we, I let him cook. There's a reason I still follow him. Even after repeated incidents of... <laughs> what did he retweet? <laughs> what I wearing right now? <laughs> What is he wearing right now? <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> non Xenoblade fans don't realize that this is like canonically the most powerful creature in the entire series. <laughs> no one even, no one bats an eye when they see that guy online. <laughs> Ooh, good song. I miss Xenoblade X, guys. I, I'm not gonna lie, I have like an like a like a, a strong desire, like the deepest parts of me desire to go whip out my Wii U and reset my save and just play Xenoblade X for like 200 hours. <laughs> I, I just wanna go on a little adventure. You know what I'm saying? Wait for the Switch port though? It's not happening, Ollie. It's not happening. Xenoblade X for the Switch isn't real. God, what a good game though. I love that game. What a fun game. It, 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 it's, it's crazy how fun the game is with how bad of a story it is. It is, it is crazy to me that they can make me want to play a game so badly. A supposedly narrative driven game when there's no, <laughs> like the narrative is like not good in X. Hey, okay, what, what? I love the concept, I love the world. Chapter five twist is good, okay, okay, sure. Yeah, great. Kiriyoki Sawano on the soundtrack, going hard. Crank that shit up, baby. Wait, wait, wait. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that's just the- this is the ocean night theme. You hear that? Never. You never hear that. You know what? Guys, I've been over this. I, the most underrated theme in all of Xenoblade X. I- I will stand by this till the day I die. Can- can you guess what it is, Ollie or, uh, Mask? <laughs> what do you want me to call you, by the way? The most underrated theme. In all Xenoblade X. You know, there's a lot of people who do not like it. They're saying, you know, this one, man, it's not great.
<laughs> Bro. <laughs> Just the snare drum quarter notes get me going. Bro. Bro, wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, I'm skipping. Hold on, we're gonna do it again. One, two, three, four. Oh, no, no, no. Bro, it goes so hard. <laughs> Why does it go so hard? I don't even know if my voice is synced up to that, but <laughs> this song I unironically think goes so hard. And there's a lot of people who hate this theme. And I have a theory about as to why. It's because they don't spend enough time there. Okay? They don't spend enough time in NLA. And so they don't really get acclimated to the climate. You know what I'm saying? If you're not spending at least a hundred hours in the game. At least 10 of that running around NLA goofing off. You're doing it wrong, okay? Okay, you guys, what do you say we actually, like, start? <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to beat two quests tonight, and I gotta... What are you calling an early 2000s jam, Ollie? No, this is not a... Early 2000s jam. You silly goofball. It has the vibe. <laughs> okay, fair. I, th I just think Sawano is great at music. <clears throat> Honestly, if I was blind or I had never played Xenoblade X, you could play a Xenoblade X song, song for me and I'd be like, that's Attack on Titan. <laughs> Bro, trying to update Mario Kart, not enough system memory. Ha! <laughs> no SD card? <laughs> no SD card? <laughs> you know the Megamind meme? Uh, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, let's let's go. Let's let's rumble. Okay. Woo! Am I in prison right now? Oh, I'm in the Agnes Castle. This area also has such underrated music. It has such great tunes. And, and it, like, it only ever plays in this very specific area. Like, bruh. Uh, uh. By the way, Ollie, I added the, um, the uh, theme you put in Discord uh, to my, uh, 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 what's it, my Nico, Mom uh, Nico Beach to Relax Less Study 2 playlist, the... Uh. The bass theme, the the great bass or whatever. I like that theme. It's a good one. It goes silly. You go silly. Okay, look at Uni. Uni's Alexandria's class right now. Who should I play as? Hmm. Would only can you blame it for being underrated? It literally only plays for like ten minutes before it, you never go there again. You know what I'm saying? Um. Okay, let's um. Okay, so I have this pulled up to get Riku Manana. I have to go to the Condensia Region Inlet Camp. Okay, there's an inlet camp among us. Inlet camp? Is it is it up here? I don't know where inlet camp would be. Aha! <laughs>
And I, oh, I have to I have to have ordered a quaza paza a la city in the city. Oh, hold on, I might not have ordered I might not have ordered that yet. Have I ordered a quaza la paza the city or whatever? <laughs> well, let's go to the, let's go to the, let's go to the city. At the uh, at the uh, Michiba Canteen. Yes, squid. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Art combos. Okay. So here's the plan. I eat the, the city pizza or whatever it's called. And then we go back to the inlet camp. Okay. Where is the canteen? Right here. Just going I have to... Nothing out of the ordinary. Should we I gotta... Yeah, I'm really you glad, you guys, that I did... Gray's Ascension quest before I shaved <laughs> because it's the same man. Oh, do you have the picture? <laughs> it's the same man. Um, order food. I want to pull up the picture. Uh, Aquaza Paza a la City. Yes, I would love this. Mm, that's good. Look at Manana going munchy crunchy. For once, something that isn't Russians. <laughs> Something that isn't rations. Cerise Caprice Aquaza Paza. Aqua Paza, sorry. My bad. Ooh, a new recipe. Can't wait. Okay. Let's That's now go back to the inlet camp. Okay. Uh map. Can see a region. Go up here. Right in here. Yes, sir. -y. Yes, sir. -oo. Yeah, I added it for you. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I'm really glad I did. I'm really glad I did Gray's quest when I looked like this. Because <laughs> this is the same man. I don't care what anyone says. That That's the same guy. Except one of them's like 60 and the other is... A 23 year old dude on twitch farting into a microphone so um uh for the audience of however many people are watching me anyways <laughs> it's a great image okay let's go inlet camp you know you've got to take regular breaks uh okay what's gray doing I guess we've we haven't really used Gray as a hero, so I wonder what he does, or like what kind of animations he has at campfires. Uh, well, we have to do laundry. Okay, I mean, obviously. I mean, come on. <laughs> See, no blade. What's going on here? What's going on right now? Okay, my bad. I'm trying to start Riku Manana's quest, and you're showing me. Something that this ain't this game. What's this game rated? What's this game rated? <laughs> this game says it's rated T for teen. I don't think so. We're dipping into M for mature category. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> <sighs> I was just about to start the rumbly grumbly side, uh, the rumbly grumbly ascension quest, aka Riku Manana, before I was rudely interrupted by. <laughs> Noah trying to keep it cool <laughs> with, with Tyon. Tyon's grinding on him. <laughs> and Senna and Mio are just having a good time. <laughs> okay. Yeah, sure. <laughs> and Gray's over here like, ugh. No, Gray's gone. <laughs> I was about to say, Gray's over there like, I remember when I did that as a wee lad. <laughs> ah, young love. To have that again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Noah's like, sorry, Mio. <laughs> it's tie on time. Okay, discuss. Um, What is it? Which one is it? I don't actually know what 
It is. Is it a disgust thing? Hold on. Um. It's at the inlet camp. Okay, so what do I have to do then? Huh. We're right here, Triton. We're right here, Juniper. Teach. Dion, Valdi. Uh. <laughs> Sagiri. Fiona. I don't know where this is. Culinary repertoire. How do I do? I'm confused. Um, on Senna, you must have a rank 10 Yumsmith on Senna and must have eaten the Aquaza Paza Ala city in the city afterward you had the inlet camp. What? It's not, why isn't it working? Why do you have so many undiscussed topics? No! <laughs> oh, I have to cook it. I didn't know I had to cook it. Maybe I don't. Uh, because I'm lazy. <laughs> That's why. That is exactly why. It's the Aquaza La Paza or whatever. This one. This one. Yes, I would love to replace my thingy. Look at that! Banana's out here looking like Gordon Ramsay. Okay. Is everyone finished? Yes. Arr, they're angry. <laughs> they're growling at each other. <laughs> okay. Does that trigger something right, now? Everyone. Time to head out. I like Berlin Byways always. That's my favorite. Oh, I know what I... I was just going to say I know what the problem is. And I look over and... Yeah, yeah. I figured it out. I figured it out. Okay, we're good. In time of need, we here to help. We here to help. <gasps> it triggers it. Oh! Hey, look at those nut on. Look at the goons over here. What are they doing? They're doing a celebratory dance of munchy munchy. <laughs> They're doing a munchy crunchy like dance. Not on not on traders. What are they dancing out there for? They're just happy. They're just having a good time. Don't you just dance? Sometimes I dance for no reason. I'll literally just be walking around my house. I'm just hitting the stankiest leg. I'll hit the the biggest nay nay. Shall we ask? Sure. Let's do it. What are you guys hey, grooving you. about? Hey you. Explain your happiness to me. Meh. Looking for bargains. Of course. What's all this dancing about then? <laughs> uh. Sometimes Nopon just want to dance. Is there law against? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Literally, I'll be in my kitchen at 3 a.m. eating a handful of shredded cheese, just hitting the stankiest leg. Absolutely grooving. Actually, I don't do that. Don't get any wrong ideas, you guys. Don't think I'm that big, much of a weirdo. I do hit the stanky leg, but I do not <laughs> do it at 3 a.m. while eating shredded cheese. Unlike most, uh, uh, most goblins. <laughs> Sometimes no pawns just want to dance. Is there a law against? No, there isn't. Already ate dinner. <laughs> Already ate dinner. Yeah, he's happy. His tummy is full and his heart is big. He's ready to rumble. He's ready to dance. You dance after eating. That's pretty unusual. Tyon, I say you're unusual for not dancing after you eat. <laughs> Tyon, I finished my bowl of mac and cheese. I'm hitting the snanky leg. <laughs> Tyon, I finished my bowl of mac and cheese. I'm hitting the gritty. Wherever I am. On the spot. It's not even slightly unusual. What silly maniac dance while eating? <laughs> okay, true. Nobody said anything about that. Okay, anyway, so why were you dancing? Yeah. Is there a law against it, Senna? Were you listening? Because just ate dinner with legendary Tempapa. Exactly! That's what I'm saying, Senna. Come on, listen. Listen up. Never have self Thiefy been this happy. So glad <laughs> to come on journey. Oh, so... <laughs> self Thiefy's having a great time. Tempapa. Legendary Tempapa. What makes him a legend? Who's Tempapa? Meh, meh. Did 
Oh, Banana knows Tempapa, the legendary Tempapa pawn. Is he famous? <laughs> Let's just say, Mio, he's the Cristiano Ronaldo of Ionios' Napon, okay? Let, uh, just, just so you can understand it. Let's just say, uh, Mio, basically, <laughs> basically, he's the ninja Fortnite of Ionis' Ionis' Napon, okay? <laughs> Wait, he's, he's the Gordon Ramsay of Ionios. And, Ma and Manana's like, oh, you know Tim Papa, the Gordon Ramsay of Ionios? He's really that good. Oh, yeah. Good as gross, understate. <laughs> Manana wants to meet Tim Papa so bad. Gross understate. He here till just now. Chase after and you catch him. Tim Papa scavenger hunt? <laughs> she can learn it. I was calling her. I was calling her Gordon Ramsay this whole time. Meanwhile, there was a Gordon Ramsay Napon in this world that we didn't even know about. <laughs> wow, he even takes apprentices. So Fifi saw him go in direction of Daedalisle. So go there to meet him. Daedalisle. Okay. Best news of Manana's life. Manana going to become apprentice. Ooh, she's so happy. And Riku's like, oh, I wanted to become apprentice. <laughs> Riku looks so grumpy, pump, grumpy, bumpy. <laughs> Here's worth shot. <laughs> Riku, you're so grumpy, bumpy. What's going on with you? Uh, we're just gonna go along with this. Uh, yeah, why not? I doubt we can simply pretend none of this just happened. <laughs> Look at how happy she is. How can you say no to that? Look at how happy she was. Culinary repertoire. She's going to learn how to make... What should she learn how to make? The ultimate dish. We're going to learn how to make banana pie. <laughs> Always nice to see a new face. Time to meet living legend alive! Time to go meet Gordon Ramsay. Sure. Banana would make... What would she make? She'd make the... Banana's famous beef stew <laughs> turn on the rocket boosters yeah this song's so good why does it only play at the very end of the game i guess it, it, well, it makes perfect sense why it only plays at the very end of the game but i want it to play more because i feel so triumphant okay can i get on there or do i have to go in the the weird way i think i have to go in the weird way Which is well, like I had to climb up here and then zip line in. <laughs> also, I want to play a Senna because I haven't played a Senna in a very long time. Rock Rock Mountain is all right, but it's noticeably less fun with Mario Kart It's gliding. They changed the gliding. You hear about the? Uh... Yes, yeah, Senna cosplay. Oh, give me that image. <laughs> I love Senna's outfit, especially because she's in the off saying outfit right now. She looks cool. I'm a big Senna fan. She may be a gremlin, but she can bench press 450 easy as a warm-up. Literally my most recent image in DMs. Okay, I'll pull it up. Thank you, Euler. <laughs> Guys, donation goal? <laughs> Guys, I'm just saying. <laughs> New $97 donation goal. I want to be a little Senna goblin. I want to be a little goblin running around town. Lifting weights and kicking ass. Is that too much to ask? I don't think so. Okay, let's go back here. <laughs> Why are you looking at her? Look at me. What are you talking about? Women are temporary. <laughs> Xenoblade is forever. <laughs> oh man, they've really gone and done it now. Senna Goblin is temporary. Xenoblade is forever. There's a there's a unique enemy over here. Oh, a level 52 
Virtuous Gulkin. All right, Virtuous Gulkin, you're going down. All right, well, just real quick, because I saw him. I mean, come on. I mean, come on. So I'm playing as a healer right now, which is honestly a pretty boring class, but... I'll do it. I'm waiting for them to break topple phase. Golkin D nets. That's true. I didn't think of that. <laughs> okay, if they daze, I will burst. They did not daze. Not oh, I have a daze. I didn't even realize I had a daze. Oh, okay. Well, good to know. Yeah, this, this guy shouldn't take too long. Is the music too loud, you guys? I think it's like barely teetering on too loud. I turned down like a smidge. Is my voice matched up with the game audio? Because sometimes I think it isn't. Okay. If they topple, please topple. I would love for you guys to topple when I go to Gaze first. Can someone please topple? Ah, there we go! Burst! Get bursted, Bozo. Ooh, look, it's Riku, the common variety not ball. Exactly! The music. Bro. The Xenoblade music just gets me hyped. It just gets me hyped. I can't not groove. I will say that if it were not... Go Santa! Go Santa! Play your little flute! Go Santa! <laughs> I will say that if it weren't for the Climax theme uh, being a thing in this game, like if it were just the regular theme without the Climax, I probably would think that it's like it was significantly worse than the first two you will know our whatever names or our blank um insert uh word here you know what i'm saying but when they added the climax oh wait i auto sold my nope on coin gold that's not good that means i have 99 gold nope on coins though uh. ollie what do i spend it on or anyone in chat also dank i didn't say hi to you i responded to you but i didn't say hi to you hello <laughs> This flute do be going hard right now, though. Max the revival gem? Why is that? Whoa, got a rare dude revival right gem. Oh, a container. Yeah, we bagsy oh, the container. It's right there, but there's no way to it. Oh, we can get it. Watch this, Lance. I'll just go around. Hey, that's not your everyday jump. The things that let non-healers revive? Yeah, I know about that. Is that a good idea, though? Because I actually don't know whether that's a good idea or not. I'm gonna go Bagsy the container. <laughs> oh yeah. Me Bagsy the container. You get one for free, you don't need two, but two is so cool. I don't know. I'm not too worried. I feel like I'll never use either of them, so I'm not too concerned. Yippee! Oh. Yippee! Let's go, Senna! Don't 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 <laughs> Senna. Mission impossible, Senna mode. <laughs> Whoa. Berlin Byways is my favorite, Ollie. I really like Berlin Byways. But not a filled with great expect me too. Nico tummy rumbly grumbly. <laughs> uh Kong versus Godzilla, anyone? <laughs> or no, is it it's Kong Kong versus Godzilla just going on right over there in the in the middle of the field. 
Oh, these guys are level 71. Agnes Blaster Elite. I can take it. Focus target, focus target. Okay. Days. I would really like to hit the burst if possible. There we go. No, I missed it. What the heck? Oh, I was like half a second too late. Yippee! Wait, what's the what's this what's this thing you sent? <laughs> what is this? What'd you send me? Manana burst with excite. Okay. I don't even know who we're attacking right now. I'm not gonna lie. It's a shame debuffs don't work in this game, because I really think Sigiri's class is, like, cool. It just doesn't work, though, so... Like, what do you do? One hour of silence occasionally broken by Senna's Yippee. <laughs> you want me to play that? Let's go, Senna. Absolutely! Say no more, says Noah. You guys want me to do Manana's side quest with one hour of silence occasionally broken by Senna's Yippee? Because I will. But I need a vote. I need democracy. <laughs> I need Squid, Ollie, and anyone listening to say whether <laughs> this is a terrible or good idea. Berlin Bios is fine. You're weird, Ollie. You're weird. Hmm. You can't. You just can't handle the byways. Clearly not. Okay. Well, you guys. Uh, she's too big. Why is she so big? Well, you guys. Uh, incoming one hour of silence, occasionally broken by Senna Yippee. Let's get it going. Yippee! Okay, let's get back to the game. <laughs> it's night time already. Okay, night time. Okay, so we got a. There's a monkey blocking the path here. Yeah, I don't really want to fight Wanak Gogol, to be honest. I feel like he'd kick my booty cheeks. And I'm not a fan. So you're telling me the Gordon Ramsay of Ionios, the Cristiano Ronaldo of Ionios, is just sitting out here on the beach with some with the crusty the crusty clan? <laughs> he actually is. Stop that! Not no. The crusty clan would never hurt a soul. Monsters have called at someone. I thought I thought me and the crusty clan were chill. Let's go help. All right, let's ride. Fast recharge. No, that's us. The crustips are coming for blood, apparently. Apparently they are. News to me. I thought we were chill back in chapter two. I was dapping over like it was nothing. You know, I was, I was, they were my homies. They were my day ones. And now I'm smashing them! <laughs> Mock punch? You're a crab, how do you know how to punch? And also, that's a Pokemon move. <laughs> that's not a Xenoblade, that's the wrong game. Okay, what is, what do we have to say? What's up, my man? I like his little hat. <laughs> He's an old timer. He's got the mustache and the old timey hat. I like it. Still alive there, mate? Uh, maybe. Are you ones who help me? <laughs> his voice. Are you ones who help me? I'm the Napon of Tasty Treats. That right? Manana and friends come to rescue. 
watch this guy just like not be the guy we're looking for like this is just like a like a random old homeless knop on it's just like wandering the sea and banana's like oh, you're my idol and he's like thank you i don't know who you are <laughs> oh, today is good day for meeting <laughs> well, now it's time to go home now time to go home well, well why not like grab a bite to eat with us or something why don't we uh why don't we go out go out to lunch or something i can pick your brain now it's time to wait i agree with manana what what Yippee! That's what I'm saying. I agree with Manana. Yippee! What, what? Manana has a request to make of Tempepa. Please take Manana as apprentice. <laughs> what? Well, I really think he's just going to be like, who the hell is Tempepa? <laughs> well, thank you for help. Oh, no, it is Tempepa. I think it'd be funnier if this was just some random, like, old dude who's just been living on the ocean for, like, three months, like, three decades. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay's ah yes Gordon Ramsay's iconic cooking implement giant hammer comically large ha comically large hammer why is it against personal doctrine to take apprentice yeah you know Napons and their doctrines I not need disciple that all but there are another thing this is this is Triton's voice actor isn't it this sounds like uh Triton <laughs> He's literally Tinkaton. <laughs> he kind of is. He is Tinkaton a little bit. It does sound like him. I'm pretty sure it is him. Listen to him talk. Use precious tool of trade for walloping. That's simply inexcusable. That sounds like Triton. It's just like a more like, like light. It's like a lighter voice because he's a little fella now. Pot is for cooking, not bashing. Tim Papa cannot teach people to disrespect tools in such manner. <laughs> That's Triton, I'm telling you. Pot is for cooking, not bashing. What are we... Wait, is Manana's, like, shield on her back? Is that a pot, or what is she talking about? <laughs> Triton took a... <laughs> Triton took a hit of a helium-filled balloon, and now we have Tim Papa. <laughs> Nop on who's so influenced by humans is not good thing. <laughs> what? We love humans. Manana, tell tell him how much you love humans. Do it. Or else. That's unnecessary. Why you two travel with humans? <laughs> Nop on. No, no. That irrelevant. Hey, what do you have against humans? You got something against humans, but mister? But have always lived a distance from humans. No, they haven't. What are you talking about? Literally in the other two games, we travel with Napon. <laughs> oh no, he's racist. <laughs> we should have figured that out by the old-timey hat and mustache. <laughs> no, he's not racist. Well, we'll see. So those are reasons why I not teach Yippee! you. Yippee! Senna, don't yippee for racism. This is bad. Bad, bad Senna, bad gremlin. Minana, understand. The spark is with this guy. <laughs> what do you say to that? I don't know. We just helped you. He could at least be grateful. <gasps> Wait. No! Manana's look Manana looks so sad. Riku's like, you don't you dare make my wifey pawn cry. <laughs> what now? You say those things after you eat cooking of Manana. The Great British Baking, the Great British Bake Off, or whatever that show's called. <laughs> you guys know that? That's like a TV show. Hang on, what's it called? <laughs> the Great, the Great British Baking Show. <laughs> no, the Great British Bake Off. Yeah, the Great British Bake Off is taking place in Splatoon. <laughs> All right, Gordon Ramsay versus Manana. The Great British Bake Off of 20XX. You tell by taste if Manana respect her tools or not. Ooh. Riku! <laughs> Riku! Oh my god! <laughs> I know, he's pretty hot. Look at him. I mean, with that haircut, how could how could you say no? You can at least do that, right? You can't be in that much of a hurry. I accept. 
seem like I have no choice. As thanks for helping Tim Papa, I go along. <laughs> His voice is so funny. How is that creature making that sound? I don't get it. He should not be able to make that sound. Question was, DS Peach Gardens ever in Mario Kart Tour? It got added last tour. It just got added, Ollie. Same with um, Sky High Sunday got added at the same time to tour as the other DLC wave pack. I really do like the trend they're going with in the Mario Kart DLC, though, where the final laps or, like, laps change over time. Because Peach Gardens, which was not a lap, like, a, a course that changes, now has the final lap going backwards. Which I think is really cool, and I like that, that direction for future Mario Kart courses. I think it's neat. Okay. I pogged IRL. <laughs> Just Peach, Peach Gardens lap three. <laughs> it's a done deal. It's a done deal. Manana is possible? Anything is possible for Manana. Manana can. Manana will not waste this chance. Let's go, Manana. Always nice to have more friends. Guys, I actually think that this is my favorite Senna outfit. I really do. I know, I, I also like her in the Gondor outfit, but I really like her in this outfit, to be honest. It's kind of like Uni in the Full Metal Alchemist. Or not Alchemist, Full Metal Jaguar. <laughs> that's, that's the wrong thing. Full Metal Jaguar or whatever it's called. It's, uh, yeah, well, Full Metal Alchemist is a, is a thing, Ollie. Yippee! I know, I love that. Senna, isn't that awesome? So, what you cook for me? Oh, I'm gonna cook you a quasa la paza la city or whatever we made earlier. Manana have just the thing. What was it they needed again? Cerise Caprice Aquaza Paza. That's what I'm saying. Easy breezy beautiful cover girl. <laughs> Here's extra special something. Show me. <laughs> and finish. And finish. This is literally Hell's Kitchen, and Gordon Ramsay is about to flame her cooking. Absolutely destroy her morale. Mmm, what this? This pride and joy of Manana. Please the feast eyes on it. Cerise Caprice Aquapaza. Aquapaza. <laughs> this certainly something. Ooh, give it a little sniff. It looks nice. So it looks really good. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. Indeed. Indubitably. <laughs> Cartoon sound How effect bite hooked? sound. Cartoon bite sound effect 2. <laughs> How is Manana as cook? Average at best. Well, did it not agree with you? Manana, you look so distraught. <laughs> and by that I mean you don't look distraught at all. Come with Tim Papa. <laughs> Come with Tim Papa right now. From here on out, I dub you Gordon Ramsay 2. Where are you going? We want to hear impressions of Manana's cooking. Yeah, we want to hear what you have to say. No more yak yakking, just follow. <laughs> Just follow the, the suspicious Nopon with the comically large hammer into the abyss. Let's go do it. Why why not? We get all the time on our in we get all the time in the world on our hands. Where is he taking us? <laughs> Where is he taking us? Manana, not quite sure, but happy to blindly follow. I love blindly following strangers. <laughs> it's my favorite thing. Oh! Not Wanak Gogol! Okay. We should be fine. Ah! Okay. <laughs> oh, he's doing the booty fart. 
Oh, the booty blast. Manana when the food is mid. <laughs> oh, he's down! Down goes Mayweather! Oh, my daze art wasn't up. I couldn't daze him. Hopefully we can get another topple off, though. Someone please topple, that'd be wonderful. Well, I'm just gonna hold on to these arts. Until they actually do everything that I'm asking them to do. There we go. Days. Burst. No, they launched! <laughs> okay, well, I mean, I guess. Sure. If not upon Maria, would you punt one for $850? Make it 950 and we got a deal. This looks <laughs> Drumstick leak. I would punt no, I would punt a knop on for like 15 bucks. Yeah, probably 15. <laughs> Alright, 10. <laughs> Alright. Okay, where's Tim Papa? Tim Papa, where are you going? Manana when the food is mid. <laughs> Wait, what are you guys talking about? Merry Mountain or whatever Yippee! was... Uh, Yippee! To the... the But the food is mid? Uh, Merry Mountain... I like that course a little bit. It's pretty okay. It's a decent original course in my opinion. It's not crazy. I like it. I think Berlin Bio is probably my favorite. <laughs> London Loop, I don't really... It's probably my least favorite of all the cities to be honest. But I haven't played the 8 version. I also haven't played the 8 version of Mario Kart 7 Rainbow Road. We'll do that another stream. Okay, tomorrow we're doing the Game Awards. Because Xenoblade 3, Pog, 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 Game of the Year, Pog, Pog, Pog. Not going to win, but still Pog, Pog, Pog. Uh, uh, and then next stream, I'll probably do Mario Kart. Uh, because it seems fun. Game Awards tomorrow. 3DS Rainbow Road clears. What do you mean? It clears. Is it the best in your opinion? Because in my opinion, Berlin Byways clears. But I haven't played it yet on... Uh, I haven't played it yet on 8. You think it'll win Best OST? I think it can win Best OST. Game of the Year? No, it can't win that. It could win Best OST. I wouldn't be completely surprised if it won huh? something. But I would also not be shocked if it didn't win anything at all. Because I could see it going either way for the other two categories that it's nominated for. Of them winning or not winning. It's called a road. It's called a rainbow road. Hi, Steggles. <laughs> Have you guys seen that video with the double dash rainbow road? Where it's like, it's called a road. It's called a rainbow road. It is a road where you go. <laughs> It's a road where you go when you die. <laughs> one of my, um, one of the conclusions I'm coming to about this game, Squid, is that I love the story. It personally resonated with me. But it, and the themes and, like, thematic, like, like, idea that it's trying to portray are extremely well done. However, I think that they try so hard to, to like, push that, that, um, thematic, like, narrative, uh, point across that sometimes the actual plot suffered because of it. If, does that make any sense? It's like, like, the actual narrative suffered because of the underlying themes that it was trying to put forward which it had already put forward previously. Huh? I don't know how to explain it. I'm thinking about making a new a whole video for uh, why I love the game, but that I've since I've been thinking about it, I, I really think that that is an issue, even though I still love it. It was great. I enjoyed every second, but 
it, it definitely struggled because it, it felt like it was trying to get the same point across multiple times instead of exploring new territory. Where are we going with Tempapa? Tempapa! He's leading us to his secret mystery cave. Ooh! It's a little shrine. What are we gonna pray to the... The food god? Tempapa hidey hole. Tempapa. <laughs> it's his house! He's a little... He's a little, uh... Uh, what's the word? What's the word... For, like... No, he's a, he's, a, he's a little goblin, but what's the actual word? He, hermit. Yeah, there it is, squid. He's a hermit? <laughs> Here is house of Tempapa. He's a hobbit? Okay. I mean, he is short. This is more like a hidey hole than a house. That's what I said. It is a hidey hole. Correct. Lopon must live far from humans. That's not true. Are you sure you don't mind bringing us here? Yeah, why are you bringing us here if you don't like humans? Well, it's not good, but when this finish, I move house. Oh, okay. <laughs> Segregation? That's what I'm saying, Steggles. He, why is he racist all of a sudden? <laughs> well, not all of a sudden. He has been for the since we met him. <laughs> Correct. This is Heidi Hole. Yeah. Yippee! I know! I love Heidi Holes, Senna! They're like my favorite thing. They kind of, yeah, they kind of waste your time by reiterating instead of introducing new concepts. I don't, because they didn't, I don't want to say they wasted your time. Because what they did, it was all well done. It just was, it, it's weird because I don't want to call it shallow because it was deep, but it, it was shallow in the grand scheme of things because it didn't really ever move past that. If that makes sense. Like, the actual themes themselves are deep. But they didn't... It, the theme, it didn't ever, like, evolve. I don't know. Some of the plot points in this game... I think were fine. But... It, uh... Yeah, I don't know. Everything... I love this game very much. But I can see places it could have done better. <laughs> my friend had a hot take saying this game looked ugly my brain had to have a deep sleep before it died of disbelief yeah this game is definitely if you're not used to this style of game it, it is probably pretty off-putting like if you're loose used to realistic looking games also um what was i gonna say your mom died of disbelief farts <laughs> What's wrong with this chat right now? You guys are being weird right now. What has gotten into you? It is 10, 11 p.m. on a Wednesday night, and you guys are farting in my chat room. <laughs> but, um... Also, did you, guys get, did you guys see how in the Game Awards trailer, the second trailer they released for Game of the Year, they... <laughs> Noah was wearing Uni's outfit. <laughs> Why is Noah wearing the bird lady's outfit? Yeah, but you really couldn't, you couldn't really tell mask in my opinion. I, I don't think that, that wasn't really that big of an issue. I think it is far more an egregious issue that they put Noah in Uni's outfit. <laughs> Um, but, um, yeah, it was interesting. You got your mom to play this game? <laughs> really? If I tried to get my mom to play a game, I don't think... Like, I don't think... Like, I don't... I don't know if she'd beat the tutorial battle. Like, she... She... she I don't think she's ever played a video game in her life. How did Noah's VA not get nominated for best performance? I say that about, um... Mio's voice actor. Mio did Xenoblade 3 and Elden Ring and didn't get nominated. Okay, let's continue with this. Yippee! I agree, Senna. Let's continue. 
I bring friends here to say thankings for meal. Thankings for meal. Cooking of banana is not bad. Is it not good though? Is it great? Cooking of banana has promise. Oh, really? Ooh, banana all blushy crushy. Do you like banana, Yolk? I like banana. Banana? Big fan. But it also not good. Hey. Okay, fair. Yeah, why didn't Tim Papa's voice actor get nominated? <laughs> you mean Triton? Um. Manana blushy crushy. Manana look like Azumarill? No, that's Tempapa. Tempapa's on the left. Manana's on the right. Manana does not look like Azumarill. Manana's orange. <laughs> um. So it, our cooking was not good, but it also wasn't bad. So it was bad. No, it was average. It not tasty. Oh, it was hasty, tasty. Taste was not bad, but that all. Okay, Tim Papa, why don't you whip us up something and blow our taste buds to the next galaxy? How about that, huh? Show us how it's done. The problem is cooking utensils and making best use of cooking utensils. Oh, okay. Making best of utensils, but food of banana should already be scrummy. You scrummy? <laughs> I was just gonna say you have to use pure silver forks, pure pure silver cutlery when you eat any food. Any fine dining must be eaten with silver silver cutlery. And then Riku says no. And then Riku be like. Banana food is yummy scrummy. Adequate scrummage. Not great. <laughs> Adequate scrummage at best. I mean, come on. <laughs> next time I make... Next time... <laughs> next time someone cooks for me, or like someone's like, Oh, try something I made. I'll be like, Hmm. Adequate scrummage, I guess. <laughs> Adequate scrummage. Not great. <laughs> not great. Correct. Tim Papa cannot allow food that is not great. Okay. Why don't you show us how it's done, Tim Papa? How can banana become great? Please teach. Yeah. Well, he told you it's all about the cutlery. It's all about the pots and pans, banana. It's something that cannot be taught, except Tim Papa have list of things that friends ought to fetch him. <laughs> Wait, we're going on a fetch quest so now? now we're going shopping. Yeah, I like the word scrummage. Adequate scrummage, not great. <laughs> and these things will make Manana's cooking even better. Well. Uh, sure, let's go with that. He's just having us run his chores. Er, ru He's just having us run his errands. Like, like, <laughs> I mean, come on. Let's go to see Salmon and get particular thing. You know Mr. Salmon? You know Salmon? 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 Correct. Item is written on this paper. Salmon will understand. Salmon will understand. Okay. Nanana and friends go obtain. And we'll be right back. The other things can we collect? The finding should be. Yes, yes, understood. Riku and friends find things for Tempapa. Riku looks very grumpy right now. He's like, how could you insult wifey, my wifey pond's cooking? <laughs> I've got Yippee! questions, but if this makes I dinner agree, taste Senna. even better, there's no way I'm going to pass up the chance. It cannot be denied that Manana's cooking has been indispensable thus far. I know, it's it's tasty tasty. Okay, then let's go and pay Mr. Sam on a visit. Let's do it. To Papa's memo. Okay. Many thankings in advance for collection of ingredients. Many thankings. Well, no use whinging. Let's get to it. <laughs> no use whinging. Okay, you know, buddy. I do whinge from time to time. I try not to. I've been trying to cut down on my whinging lately. Um. <laughs> wait, you don't ha you don't like some of the voice acting? You don't like Riku's voice actor? I like Riku's voice actor. I think it's funny. Or I think it it wasn't. I agree that I probably would have cast the character different if I was hiring for the job or the role. However, 
I'm never like, ah, I hate this. I've never been like, I hate this Tariku. Yeah, when, have we ever had a deep, sexy Napon voice? Now we have Riku. My man. Honestly, I, I was talking to my friend um, in real life about this. We were talking about how, like, we, aside from Istard's chapter three scene at the end of chapter three, he just reads all of his lines really weird. And I don't want to say he's a bad voice actor, but it's like, they really didn't have, like, another take of him reading that line. <laughs> Every once in a while, Isard will read a line that's, like, not in chapter three, like I said. Chapter 3 was great. That's not in Chapter 3, and I'm like... That's that's the line they went with? Okay. <laughs> What's up, Simon? Why everyone come here together? <laughs> Why everyone come to household of Salmon? Riku and friends have request. Ooh. Boise, a certain Nopon asked us to give this to you. He's going to be like, oh, my arch nemesis, Tempapa. Right now, it's busy time, even if give paper. Someone not sure what friends it's. He's like, oh, rut row raggy. What? What is it? You make this Tempapa? <laughs> of course, the legendary Tempapa pawn. Yes. It's Tempapa who asked us to do favor. Yippee. Yippee indeed, Tempapapon Big Pog. How'd you meet with him? He's unbelievable. Is Tempapa a friend of yours? Let's say that, yeah. Friend? That guy? <laughs> I hate that guy. He's an asshole, and he's racist. <laughs> Meh. There's nothing gained by such conversation. He'd tell us to fetch certain item. Can you provide item? <laughs> Racism, weird champ. Not on for errand, rude. Why friends do this? As usual, he used not on for errand. Why friends do this? Uh, cause why not? He make Manana apprentice in return. I don't know about that. I don't think he ever promised apprentice? that. Apprentice? What nonsense you thinking? <laughs> a legendary Sheffy pawn. But also precious ambition of Manana. Chefy pawn. What did they say at the earlier in this game? At some point, they're like, they're like, banana is greatest cookie pawn. And I was like, fellas, we all need ourselves a cookie pawn. Am I right? Dap me up right now. Let's go. <laughs> Chefy pawn. I mean, me a cookie pawn. <laughs> no, there, there is super villain pawn. I remember that one. <laughs> Chefy pawn. He becomes Chefy Pon when Samon not looking. <laughs> Wait, what was he before this? Huh? You didn't know? He's Gordon Ramsay. He always show up out of blue to trade weird stuff. Okay. Recently, he not show up at all. Samon thought he most likely dead in ditch <laughs> somewhere. Well, that's harsh, Salmon. <laughs> yeah, he's probably dead in a ditch. Eh, I don't need to go check, though. So, this what Tim Papa want. Take and get gone. <laughs> get out of here. Oh, thanks. Okay, well, we got something. We got Simone's thing. Tell Tim Papa this thing from me. It not kill Tim Papa to bring things salmon like every once in a while. <laughs> what, a tasty treat for salmon? We tell him. Salmon. And tell him to bring back hard iron he take two years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Um, hey, Tempapa, I had two stacks of iron in this chest. Did you take them? Tempapa's like, nope, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Meanwhile, Tempapa's got like a beacon over in his base built out of like pure iron blocks. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. And Samon's still waiting for payment for use of Anvil. That's what I'm saying. It's literally Minecraft. 
Then Papa was literally repairing his netherite armor. And Salmon said, get your own anvil. Yippee! Get your own anvil. Yeah, yippee, Senna, I agree. Meh. How many things you want us to tell? Okay, let's go. Let's ride Broncos country. Okay, uh, Among Us. Wait, where do I have to go? Wait, what does it say? Hold on. Oh, I have to gather things. Wait, how do I do this? I need acid re resistant Quarmu shell. <laughs> and I need Lagoonite. I think it shows up on map. Okay. Well, it's not showing up on this map. Uh, maybe it does. It doesn't look like it's showing up. It would be yellow, right? It'd be. Oops, my headphones just turned off. Hang on, give me one sec. Well, the yellow exclamation point's not showing up, so I don't know where to look for this. I'll just Google it if I have to. It's not a big deal. Where do I get Lagoonite? Ugh. How do I, um... Free Zizzle. Ah! Ah! <laughs> What's up, you guys? Ricky's sons? These are not Ricky's sons. This is Salmon. <laughs> If Ricky's sons are racist, then yes, this is Ricky's sons. <laughs> you guys want to see something really cool? Check this out. <laughs> Among Us in Xenoblade 3. <laughs> ah, ah. Sussy? Very sussy. The Among Us, the Among Us is real. What are you guys all doing tuning into my stream? <laughs> You're, if you, those of you who don't know, these are I know these people in real life. What are you goons doing here? <laughs> um, okay, let's, um, we need to go to the Cadencia region. I think, I think we just need to go here. Because, actually, I'm going to look it up. I don't know where to get Lagoonite. 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 Where do I get this? Okay. The Malevolent Hollow. Where the heck is the Malevolent Hollow? What the heck does that mean? Where's the Malevolent Hollow? Where the heck? Isn't it down here? Aha! The malevolent hollow. Okay, so there's a there's allegedly lagoonite here, whatever that is. I don't know why we're oh, yo, this area is actually sick. But the dudes are level ninety five. <laughs> okay, I can't fight these guys. Not like look of that enemy. Prink meduse. That sounds like a slur. <laughs> what, what? What is that? Okay, I need lagoonite. Where do I get Lagoonite, you guys? Oh, there's something on the ground there. Is that Lagoonite? <laughs> Chromar fossil? Okay. Oh, 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 wait. It's the exclamation points. Lagoonite! <laughs> yes! Yippee! Yippee! I know, Senna! It's so great! We got some Lagoonite! Okay, well, there's one down there, so I, I gotta go get it. I might alert the level 96... Uh, fella. Okay, we're going up. <laughs> okay, so we have Lagoonite. Now we need acid resistant Quarmu shell. What does that mean? What is an acid resistant Quarmu shell? Huh? Where is this? Um, in the south part of the sea. Bluish walruses with shells on their back. I can 
be found in the sea south of the first pillar remnant. South of the first pillar. Okay, I don't know what that means. Okay, Squid, help me out here. So if like I go like theoretically like over here, and I just like warp to like I don't know like just a random beach, like like we're gonna go to this beach. We're gonna go to this beach. I know there's a beach here, and if we kill these enemies on the beach. Oh wait, is that them? Is that a Quarmu? <laughs> Quite a rare sight. Desert Poggle? Hello? Is that an enemy? Or is that just like flora? What the where are these dudes? How do I find these guys? It's a Quarmu. I know it's not those guys. A quarrel of Quarmu. That's what I'm trying to find. <laughs> You're right, Freezizzle. Are you talking about my squad following me? I love my squad. Look at Riku and Manana. Look at them run. I love their running animation. I think you're on the wrong beach. I do. I got an entire palace behind me. Okay, uh, I'm on the wrong beach, apparently. Where should I go? Where's the nearest beach that's not here, though? I have Among Us. Oh, there's some here. There's some here. I know. I read an article online that said there were some on this beach. Okay, Quarmu. And I need how many? Three? That's a, that's a Musketeer Gulkin. What is that? Javelin Moringa. Marigna. <laughs> Urkon. I don't know. Where are they? Hold on. I literally just read that they were here. They can be found in the sea south of the first pillar remnant. Well, isn't that literally right here? Oh, I see them. I see them. They're out there. Okay, get on the boat. Boat time. Boat pog, boat pog. Okay, there's... Oh, oh they're, they're right there. Slow down. Disembark. Where are you? Yes, Quarmu, my boy. Well, oh, I get to hear the Pirates of the Caribbean theme. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this boat, though. <laughs> Alex, this... <laughs> <laughs> this kind of look like you. Nah, Mateo, this, this enemy kind of look like you. I agree, Senna. I, uh, yeah, it is so much nicer in this game. In Xenoblade 1 and 2, you couldn't fight in the water. And it was very obnoxious. I got one. Alright, well, we need to go kill two more of these guys. I'm gonna go, uh,. Swim a triathlon real quick. Don't mind me. <laughs> hey, what do you have against Riku and Banana, the best characters in the game? You just called Mateo the best character in the game, Freezizzle. <laughs> Valiant Cry, he's going. Arr, 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 arr. Oreo. <laughs> I, I agree. It, it sounds like you're saying Oreo. It's like that one, uh, whatever that video, or yeah, it's that video of, um, uh, what's it called? Mio. She's saying Oreo, but it sounds like she's saying Oreo. <laughs> Mammon Quardoon. Wait, is this guy? Is this not what I'm looking for? It doesn't have a. Oh. Okay, well, this one has the exclamation point on it, so I'm going to do that one. Not the Oreo spoiler. It's an art squid. <laughs> you can't have a... It, it's literally an art. Okay, 
How is that a spoiler? Okay, Mama and Kwarmu. So is this guy guaranteed to drop me a shell or whatever? So the reason we're getting this shell is because we have to go gather ingredients for a racist hermit. <laughs> Xenoblade 3 is crazy, man. <laughs> I'd say we were moving in sync, right, Tile? Man, Xenoblade 3 do be crazy. Okay, I need to sail around the edge now. I do be swimming in my boat. I love the boat theme. Boat theme is my favorite theme in this game. That's not true. That's not true. The boat theme is not my favorite theme. <laughs> okay, so now here's what we need to do. We need to hop out. And we need to go back to this, this hermit's house. You know, Free Zizzle, I don't know if you're being sarcastic, but I actually, I do agree. <laughs> What's my top three songs? Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh... This is number one? I don't know if this is number one. I don't know about that. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, the music in this game is actually goaded. It's it's very, 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 very good. Sun's out. Makes walking that much easier. Um, top three songs? Oh, God. I don't know. Oh, huge. Dare I say even massive for the program, Mateo? Free Zizzle. Ah! Thank you. Mwah. Peace. Hey guys, now you have access to the best emote on Twitch, aka I Nico Buddy. <laughs> this was a nice find. And also I Nico Poggies. <laughs> Thank you. Yippee! Yippee! Uh, top three songs. I'm trying to think, what's my favorite battle theme? Probably the elite monster. Mm, I don't know. Cause there's, I also like words that never, never reached you, but that's like an emotional battle theme. Hey yo. Los triplos. <laughs> Look at all you being nice to me. What is up with this? Unbridled kindness with you all. You're being so weird tonight. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. All three of you. That was very nice of you. And I appreciate it. And, uh... For, for at least the next month, you get to listen to me farting into a microphone on the corner of the internet. Uh, and that's... That's that's worth $2.50, in my opinion. <laughs> Maybe, tops. Maybe three tops. Would you like a balloon? Important question. I, um, my, I like Senna's going crazy right now. Look at this action shot. Um, my favorite theme, I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. What's my favorite theme? Oh! In the oh! Ah! Oh! Jesus. Oh! Scared me. Squidward cheered. X five. Squidward, you get in those. The call, Where did you find those bits on the side of the street or something? <laughs> hype train. I think the last time I had a hype train in my Twitch chat was like two years ago. Maybe. Like at least it was over a year ago. Little buddy ate them all. <laughs> Squid, thank you. That's very kind of you. I'm not serious. I will. I, I'm, I'm trying to make. I'm trying to go big content mode, Nico Brain Streamer Man. But oh! at the same time. Oh! Uh -oh. oh! Hold on. Only TC cheered. X10. It's man. time. Man, man dancing. dancing. Man, man dancing. dancing. 
man dancing, 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 Various coins and nickels and dimes for my own perusal. Mm, yes. Mm, yes. You guys know what I'm gonna buy with this? You guys know what I'm gonna buy? Get the pick, oh, get the pick right now. Guys, new <laughs> donation goal. New donation goal on stream, ready? <laughs> Let's make it happen. <laughs> Can we please? It's only a low, low price of $96. <laughs> oh! Oh, God. Oh! 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 The final mask cheer. Oh. X1000. Little buddy just threw these up in front of me. Oh. Go. <laughs> Yippee! Yippee indeed, Senna. Little buddy just vomited out <laughs> a thousand bits. Blah! Guys, look, for those of you that didn't see, look what came in the mail today. Look at this. Look at this guy. I love him. He's my favorite man of all time. <laughs> Literally the coolest. People are calling this guy the chillest dude in America. <laughs> you want him? I have him. I have him right here. He's great. Guys, thank you. You're being a thousand bits. That's a lot, Mask. I really... That, that is not a small amount. Thank you very much. Especially because Twitch overcharges you for those. Man, you guys are being all nice to me, making me feel all warm and fuzzy and such. <laughs> What's going on with you? You're all being so weird. All right, let's, let's go talk to the racist. You guys don't mind, right? Tempapa! <laughs> I brought your... <laughs> Goodies. Yes, about this size may just suffice. Okay, why did we bring you these though? What is purpose of use? Cooking on my nana. The problem is that it lacked tools, oh, technique, and she soap. didn't have the right preparation. Now even more things missing. To get best out of ingredients, must use condiments. Ketchup, to mustard, get best onion, technique, relish. Need special something. Everything, banana. Can teach special something. <laughs> That question? Wait here for Tick. Manana's gonna whip up a sick, spicy sriracha mayo in about two seconds. Oh, Lan's doing push-ups. Uh, bird lady. Just how long this going to take? Maybe he steal away goods and scarper with. <laughs> Who steal away and scarper with? <laughs> I, I don't know. On with spotless reputation. You do have a, a comically large large. You do have a comically large hammer on your back, so I wouldn't put it past you. When old like me, you understand value of nap. <laughs> Stay up all night is out of question. He just went into his house so and took Papa a nap. Just went away for taking nap. Yep. That right. Nap has revealed wisdom to Tim Papa. <laughs> uh -huh. What this? <laughs> What's the wisdom? Get a pot. But Manana have one of those too. Oh. Oh, I think. Not. Is she gonna get a new pot? A pot like this. It's sad to say, but pot of Manana cannot make up for lacking things. She uses her pot as her weapon. It's heavy duty exclusive Nupon brand pot. Oh! Ah! Oh! Ah! ah! <laughs> Squidier cheered. Did little buddy vomit six. those too? I was gonna say that's a lot of bits. I think that's a that's a thousand in total, right? Yeah, little. That's a lot. Those are the those are the leftovers. That's little buddy's dinner. You just vomited in front of me. <laughs> I, I this is cool though. I think Man Manana's gonna get a new pot from a racist man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. User choose tool of trade. It's true, but also fact of tool choose user. Okay. Uh, this is tool of trade. It's true, but also fact that tool choose user. Part of Manana, shape become all warped from use in battle. Oh, because she uses it in battle. Like okay, that. true. Mama, that was problem. What is the exact point of wielding cooking pot as weapon? 
that fly overhead of Tim Papa. <laughs> you have a comically Ooh. large ha large hammer How on your back. What are you talking so about? Careless with utensils, even when show such great promise as Chef Epon. Manana gonna be the next Gordon Ramsay. Chef Epon Deluxe. It's true. This pot suit Manana down to ground. The more Manana cook with, the better Manana Yippee! cook. Yippee! Manana got a new pot. Yeah. Cooking of banana, not actually so bad. But tools simply not able to keep up with level of skill. That make cooking sad, and utensils sad too. Yes. Oh, I don't so know what he's talking about, but... Tools aren't up to scratch. That right. It's all a question of feeling. I guess. Love is very important thing for technique and cooking. Okay. Um, what about <laughs> teaching us some actual cooking? No, it's all about the love you put into it. Tempapa not specially so much a cook. Word on Creepvine was Tempapa legendary chef Yeah. Tempapa just make new cooking utensil, nothing more. Cooking of beans, they just to make sure utensil work. Meh meh. Tempapa not actually legendary chef You're not the Gordon Ramsay of this realm? some lopon call Tempapa that. Tempapa choose not to refute spreading rumor. <laughs> Is that all there was to it? Yeah, if you guys called you me say? the Cristiano Ronaldo of Twitch, I'm I'd be like, it nice I'm not saying no. <laughs> I'm not going to refute Picture's it. Cool, lone, wonderful. Uh, can't believe this. <laughs> it's okay. Manana not mind at all, lad. Yeah, Manana got a new pot. Manana learned ins and outs of cook pot. Yes. To make tapest of top food, Having of best utensils is required. Manana would never realize this if not learn lesson from Tempapa. That alone make Tempapa worthy of title of Master Pon. Yeah. Only one thing left. Sure, Manana. Manana. Can't wait to get stuck in with making food. <laughs> get pot used to fire nice and slow. Ooh. That a slow roasted. What are we making? Some beef stew? Really Also, spirit and personality. Getting a bit much. <laughs> oh, ha, ha. And pinch of motivation. I love her voice and her animations. They're so funny. And good, and I like them. Oh. Oh. We're making that tasty banana battle soup. Ooh. That actually looks extremely delicious. Yummy scrummy, even. <laughs> Tasty. <laughs> Riku's over there with a stack of like eight hamburgers <laughs> going crazy. <laughs> mm, it's so different from before. Mm, I could eat piles and piles of this. <laughs> yeah. How the spark can one pot change so much about a dish? Uh, it's, uh, it's laced with a hallucinogen drug. <laughs> the the pot is coated with uh shrooms that's how that is how mio <laughs> it's <laughs> it's non-stick yeah before manana was using a stick pan now tempapa gave us a non-stick pan <laughs> it's laced with pollen orbs <laughs> sent us over there tripping balls warp of pot is warp of heart and warp of heart is warp of cooking Okay, I don't know what that means, but sure. Also, guys, thank you for being so nice with the hype train. We got to level three? Three? Is that what we got to? I think so. You guys are cool. Thank you. 2,000 bits and three subs? <laughs> thank you. <laughs> um. What? <laughs> what? Though it also plenty true that beloved tool will create beloved food. Yes. But you still consider it unthinkable Yippee! to wield as a weapon. Yippee! Truth be told, that part still rubs oh, that's big. the wrong way. That's big. That's big pog right there. It's huge pog. There I said it's massive. Um, <laughs> I really like how we're just eating. Like Riku and Mio are both eating like 19 hamburgers. Thanos. I don't think Thanos works. Wait, I didn't connect the thing. I forget to do this sometimes. Okay, Squid, I'll refund you. Or no, I won't refund you, I'll do it for you. Hang on. 
Give me one sec. Ready? Okay. Now we're good. We're in the clear. Thanos. Ride. My child. Wait, ready? Go. <laughs> did he not go? Wait, did I not set it up right? Wait, 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 wait. Did I not set it up? Wait. Wait, wait. It, will it go in this scene? Thanos? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> okay, well, for some reason that doesn't work in this scene. I'll, I'll have to fix that later. Okay. <laughs> he runs with such gusto. He runs ferociously. He's running with intent. But from a such a drive, such power. Could tell Manana made with talent without understanding of how to use to. Yeah. She was basically cooking on a on a with she was cooking with a couple twigs and a rock and she made a quasi la paza a la city or whatever. I don't that know what was it was called. That really needed correction. Ooh. Is Tempapa eating well? Tempapa only eat little, cannot gorge self like young buck. <laughs> Manana is making more! No fear! Look at the little two-step jiggy she is doing right now. Do Riku also have difficulty getting along with humans like Tempapa? Oh, Riku lore? There are many things one can only attain by cooperation and speak with others. <laughs> Okay, it had to have been the humans that gave you that haircut, though, Riku. If not travel with There's no, no way you chose that haircut for yourself. have chance to eat cooking of Manana now. Indeed. Riku, very strange, Nopo. Uh, or maybe the strange one is you, living out here like this. <laughs> yeah, you're literally a hermit who hates all humans. Hmm. This Nopo way of living. Come, come. Everyone eat up nicely now. Riku will have some. Not forget to treat tools with care. That only thing friends must remember. Okay. So this guy isn't a total dirtbag. He just wanted us to use a nice pot. <laughs> okay. Manana promise. Look how happy she is. All right. Good job, Manana. Yippee! Yippee! That's what I'm saying. Manana's weapon grew stronger. Wait. I thought that. <laughs> how did it grow stronger? I thought we were supposed to use this weapon for cooking and not fighting. Hey, Culinary repertoire. repertoire. Turned out Tempapa is a blacksmith, not a cook. Still, it wasn't all for nothing, as Manana got a brand new pot to make even more delicious meals with. Pog, 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 pog. Hero class rank limit broken. Peerless Riku and Manana. Yum, Smith. And now reach level 20. Let's go. That's hype. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nop on caravan level increase. Nice! Should we go do uh, Miyabi now? Which one should we do now? Is Miyabi a long one? Is Miyabi... Because it's already 10.45 and I want to edit more tonight because I want to have a video up by Friday. What is the shortest one I could do? Like tonight. Because I don't want it to be a long stream. Like, is like Monica or Gondor a short one? Because they seem like characters that would have a short one. I'll do I'll do Miyabi. Let's do Miyabi. Let's do Miyabi. Let me see. Let me look it up real quick. I'm gonna do Miyabi. Because I've heard good things about Miyabi. Okay, so I have to go to the Michiba Canteen, which is in the city, and then I have to have her in my party. Okay, that's it. Okay, cool. Okay. Let's go to... Um, the city.
Let's go to Ichiba Canteen. Let's put uh let's put her in my party. Let's call it a day. Let's actually not call it a day because we're gonna do the quest. I wonder what her quest is gonna be about. What would Miyabi's quest be? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> what are you pogging about? What are you pogging over right now? Miyabi. I won't falter. I like not Miyabi. Change this world. Clueless. That's making me hungry. There's not a thought behind those eyes, is there? Okay, Miyabi. What'll it be? Yeah, you can't always give a hundred percent. Oopsies. Oops. Hey y'all. What? Yippee! No, Scott the Waz. <laughs> Sorry, I was trying to cancel out of the Yippee video. <laughs> Ignore Scott the Waz. Ignore Scott the Waz. You didn't hear that. <laughs> uh, discuss. Wait, so I have to discuss something? There's something with... Uh, there's something with... What are we playing? Hi, Bao. We're playing Xenoblade, and we're going to do a quest about something. How do I do this? We already became Gordon Ramsay. How do I do this quest? Um. Complete the quest, side story, Mio, and have Miyabi in your party at the Michiba Canteen. Well, what the heck? How do I? Why isn't it working? He's in my party. Somewhere I just walk? Oh, okay. Everyone got their strength back. Oh, it's over here. Maybe? Maybe right here? Miyabi moment? Ooh. It seems pretty lively over there. What's the occasion? I don't know. There's supposed to be some kind of cooking contest. Maybe they're preparing for it. A cook-off? Wait, we're gonna beat Gordon Ramsay twice in one stream? Uh -huh. Someone say cooking contest? Whoa. You think they'd let me participate? <laughs> no, Lance. You would burn all the food. The Great British Bake Off, part two. Huh? I didn't know you cooked, Lance. Didn't you beat this game already? Yes, I did. But I want to do all the side content, because it's good content, and I like it. And they're like... It's fully voice acted, and like there's some cool cutscenes, pog cutscenes in it. But yes, I did beat this game. Me? Nah. I'm all about the eating. Think of all that grub. All that grub. Ah, oh, maybe I should join too. <laughs> Senna, we need to get you some protein powder, girl. I'm telling you, we get we get Senna on some creatine, some protein powder, bro. Senna eats one Slim Jim, she is unstoppable. I I firmly believe that. Hey there, folks. Hey there, folks. What? Oh, Monica, Travis, what's up? Monica, we just heard about this cooking contest. Yeah, it's kind of a tradition around here. You know how the world is. Can't set foot outside without putting yourself in danger. There's a traditional cooking contest in the city? Okay. People are going stir crazy or shut up with nowhere to go. Okay, fair. They need a bit of light entertainment to diffuse some of that stress. So these contests are kind of a regular thing. This seems like the perfect opportunity for you to join in. Ooh. What should we cook? Sample the food. <laughs> what was that line delivery? Just sample the food. <laughs> Just sample the food. <laughs> he was so excited. Ah. Uh... I'm afraid the judges are selected by majority vote. They've already been decided well in advance. Oh! Do you see Lance and Senna were both like, no! <laughs> so you'd like us to join as chefs? Yeah. Yes! Count Manana in! Manana been champing at bit for cookery action! <laughs> Champing at bit for cooker reaction. Me too. I love not on dialogue in Xenoblade 3. They perfected it. <laughs> yeah, this event's pretty much made for Manana. Oh, Manana's gonna cook up a tasty treat that can't be beat. 
just watch. What? Word! <laughs> Word! That's awesome, Banana. Miyabi? Miyabi moment? Could I? <gasps> she wants to cook. <laughs> There's not a thought behind those eyes, is there? It's okay, Miyabi. <laughs> Could I join as well? Of course you can join. I like your spirit. You're both very welcome. Yeah. Looks like you'll have your work cut out for you, eh, boss? Miyabi has a very special dish that she, dish that she makes called special toast. It's toast, but it has cinnamon and sugar on it. It's called special toast. It's very tasty. I'm sure the judges will love it. <laughs> Miyabi clears the competition. <laughs> you said it, Travis. I'll let you prepare the lucky spice. The lucky spice? Oh, crap. Not that stuff. <laughs> what is the lucky spice? There are no binding rules, no <laughs> themes to follow. You're free to make whatever you like. Can I make an eight foot tall birthday cake? But you are expected to bring your own ingredients. Ooh. Once you have them, take them to Michiba at her canteen. She'll hold on to them for you. Ooh. Here what are we going to cook? I'll see you at the contest then. Oh, we're winning first prize. Wait, who's going to win? Miyabi or Manana? I'm rooting for Miyabi. She's got to get a dub. Manana just had her dub. It's Miyabi time. Miyabi moment. Looking forward to it. Manana not pull punches. We rivals now, Miss Miyabi. Oh god, Miyabi, she's Miyabin. <laughs> My favorite part of Miyabi's Ascension quest is when she pulled up to the Great British British Bake Off and went, It's Miyabin time! And then Miyabi'd all over the competition. It's my favorite part. <laughs> I love that. Yes, let's do this. I love Miyabi. Miyabi's one of my favorites. Since when did you learn to cook, Miyabi? You never told me. Does she know how to cook? <laughs> I've only dabbled, really. She dabbles in the dark arts. She knows how to make pizza rolls, that's about it. Right. We better go out looking for our ingredients, eh? Alright, let's go. Hold, Hold on. We haven't even decided what we're going to make yet. Yeah, Lance, are you making something? Ah, uh, just testing it. <laughs> just testing it, yeah. It was totally not a fluke. Before we decide, maybe we should ask around the city first. See what kind of foods they like. Their favorite seasonings. Ooh. That should give us enough to make a start on. Ooh. So she's surveying the whole town. True. We need some kind of direction to start with before we can think about making anything. Something What's on up? Your mind, Mia. Ooh, what are they what are they gonna have a little talk about? I was just thinking, it's unusual for Miyabi to voice her interest in something like this. Yeah, she's usually pretty shy, but maybe she wants to cook up a little secret secret snack. A little secret tasty treat. Before, she'd always try to avoid anything that involved competition. Ooh. So this is kind of a surprise. Miyabi wasabi. <laughs> she's cooking up a mean Miyabi wasabi. It'll rock your taste buds, Mio. Huh, I see. Well, all the more reason for us to cheer her on. Yeah. Yeah. Happiness? Wait, it's called happiness? Oh, this is going to be very wholesome, isn't it? Right, okay. Time. Q uh, baby. <laughs> isn't that the Napon that stole Ethel? <laughs> From naughty boy Q baby. He calls himself Naughty Boy QBB, and he's a he's, he's a little nop on. Basically, in the Kamarabi Hero Quest, uh, he stole a twelve-year-old girl, <laughs> and he's like Naughty Boy QBB. <laughs> Can we find out something from me? Naughty Naughty Boy QBB. Nibble dipped in chocolate sauce the other day. She gave me a nibble. Oh, chocolate sauce. That's fun. Why is she hiding back here? 
And also, what's what are they doing up there? What's my party doing up there? They're, they'll, they'll be down here shortly. Oh, the cooking contest. So it's that time already. Is it really as popular as they say? Yeah, it is. Not just because of the contest itself, but because everyone gets a bite of the winning dish. I reckon a lot of people are looking forward to that part. I know I am. But you know, I think I'd enjoy it more if I was something I could cook myself. They always prepare nothing but the finest ingredients. Must be tough finding all that. I bet you could still make a delicious meal with perfectly ordinary stuff. Yes, put in a little effort and you can make uh, any meal tasty. That's true. That's definitely one way of looking at it. Interesting. Ooh, guess we need to go gather more info. Okay, wait, this one's kind of closer. Okay, so we need two more pieces of info over there. Okay. Ah. Are you QBB! <laughs> I think Naughty I boy, QBB! So you're entering the cook-off too, are you? It looks like we're getting another great turnout. By the way, we wanted to ask, what sort of dishes did they present in the past contests? Oh, we've had just about everything you can think of. Strange delicacies, traditional meals, all sorts. Um, so what sort of food usually ends up being the favorite? Oh, they love just about anything, so do whatever inspires you. You can't really game the system since you only learn who the judges are going to be that day. That's tricky. If it were me, though, I'd look for a flavor that would appeal to the widest audience. Ooh, okay. Special toast! Cinnamon, sugar, bread, butter. The tastiest toast imaginable. <laughs> Miyabi wasabi. <laughs> We're gonna make the Miyabi wasabi. Meh, cooking contest. That had almost slipped off mind of Kubibi. Quickly, must engorge on delicious dishes. Ah, oh, you look like you're looking forward to this. Not look like am. Kubibi has high hopes for real deal make meal to make peepers pop. <laughs> I love it when meals make my peepers pop. So it's likely people want something with a bit of oomph, yeah? Unexpected dish is surely to take judges by wildfire. Fierce, fierce wave of emotion blazed through taste buds. Take them by surprise with that dish that leaves powerful impression. That seems like a good direction to lean in. Whatever is presented, QBB still be perfectly happy as long as meal is tasty. Ah, so you don't even care. Well, I do see where you're coming from. It's like that. Have you guys ever seen that YouTube video where it's like, this guy, is he's having like a spoonful of something. He's like, sweet, salty. Covers all 9,000 taste buds. You know what I'm talking about? Does anyone know what I'm talking about? Someone has to know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Beer vanilla? <laughs> all 9,000 taste buds. That's a tent. <laughs> or something like that. I don't know. Mmm. -hmm. Rosanna? Oh, this is the, uh, Grey. Is this Grey's wife? We're taking part in the cooking contest as well. I look forward to seeing your entries. Yeah, we're gonna rinse the, rinse this competition. How about that? You wouldn't happen to know any kind of ingredients are, what ingredients are popular around here, do you? Hmm, well, the city folk are quite partial to big hearty meals. You can't go wrong with that. Hearty, eh? We're always busy doing one thing or another. Perhaps that's why. We like our meals with a punch and, a lar and in large portions. Yes, I can definitely see it being popular. It's just my opinion, though. I can't speak for the whole city. But anyway, good luck. Did she just disappear? Did she just evaporate? <laughs> Replaced with the child. Okay. <laughs> okay. Gone. <laughs> Reduced to atoms. Turned into a child. The fountain of youth. Okay, so we need to head and discuss the topic now. Good to know. Noted. Miyabi's about to go on diners, drive-ins, and dives. Where's Guy Fieri in the city? God, my headphones just turned off again. I don't know why they keep doing this. Turn on. It only does this, like... When nothing, it thinks nothing is playing, but something is playing. Okay. 
Let me try to reset my audio real quick. Okay. So now we gotta go discuss this. I've already got food on the brain. Okay, discuss. Miyabi, what kind of tasty treat are you gonna make? Cooking contest. And today's story is. Everybody's super excited for this contest. Most likely they're excited about getting a taste of the winning meal. Hey, Miyabi, can I ask you something? Hmm, sure. You didn't enter the contest just because you wanted to win, did you? Uh, no, I didn't. It's because I feel indebted to the people of the city. I wanted to take this opportunity to show them my appreciation. Ooh, an, an appreciatory thank you meal. Oh, how sweet. That's just like you. Yeah, you haven't changed a bit. You've always been like this. Maham, regardless of ulterior motive of Miyabi, Manana is in it to win it. Man, she really is British, saying in it. <laughs> not in it. In it. With two ends. Will not hesitate to clash with full force of Manana might. That's totally fine, Manana. Give it your all. All right, let's go over what we've learned. From what we've heard, we should serve a huge portion of something with flavor that packs a wallop. Red Lobster Cheddar Biscuits. That's down to get the city folk going crazy. Their taste buds... That's down to get the city folk's taste buds going doki-doki. <laughs> it seems that the presentation is also highly regarded in addition to flavor. Something like... Something will deliver... Something that will deliver an impact. An impact, huh? That's setting the bar pretty high. Others were saying they'd like homemade dishes, something they'd feel familiar with. Given that we don't know who the judges will be, it might be best to just go for something neutral that everyone can enjoy. So doesn't this just mean that they'll enjoy pretty much whatever we throw at them? Yeah, but it has to be big and pack a punch. In that case, I think I know what it might be good to try. Meh, meh, meh. Secret weapon of Manana will guarantee surefire win. Hmm, you're looking pretty confident there, love. Meh heh heh, that's cause Manana already thought up ultimate recipe of ultimate delicious. <laughs> I love the way she talks, it's so funny. I love it. Why does she talk like that? <laughs> Current name of dish is closely guarded secret. And look at her, she looks devilish. She's like meh heh heh heh. <laughs> ah yes, you don't want to be telling us, telling your competitors. Exactly, anticipation. Exactly, anticipation must be sev. Nico, words. Exactly, anticipation must be savored. Looks like you two have already got your entry sorted. Guess next up. Guess next. Guess next up. Getting the ingredients. Jesus. What, what do you need for your dish, Manana? Man, Manana will need model marble Aries meat, killjoy crusted meat, cozy rogel eggums, and lucky marin thick cuts. <laughs> Yeah, you know, just everyday ingredients. Uh, yeah, huh, they're a pretty big deal is what I'm getting here. How about you, Miyabi? Um, smooshy rice, refreshing perun hacks meat, glitter radishes, and soy primo sauce. Though we can probably ask the city folk to share some with us. Huh, that all sounds pretty, like, pretty average stuff. Yes, um, I'd really like to prepare something that anyone can make using familiar ingredients. Yeah, you're totally winning pe people over that way. So who to start with? Uh, Miyabi. We can start with Miyabi. Thank you. I hope you'll f you'll find them without much trouble. A homely cook Miyabi is indeed, indeed. I'm all refreshed and ready to take on the world. Okay. So we need to talk to Boxy in the city. Where's Boxy? Shrimple enough, enough oh, lands. <laughs> I agree. What is he saying? Shrimple enough. <laughs> These ingredients are shrimple enough to find. Okay, uh, let's go over here. Oh, Boxy. Boxy. Maybe we should ask her. Does she know? Does Miyabi know Boxy? What the heck? Boxy! Boxy! <laughs> Hi, Boxy. Oh, hey, Miyabi. You're with your friends today. Yeah. 
Yes. Sorry if we're bothering you. Not at all. Not at all. Always nice to see you. Foxy. So what brings you here? We want to cook some miyabi wasabi. Actually, I've decided to enter the cooking contest. Oh, really? Yeah. I'd like it if you came. Look at Santa. She's like, go miyabi. I can. Go miyabi, go. I am part of the miyabi fan club. Sweetie, I would love to. I'll be cheering you on all the way. There's one other thing. I have a request. If it's not too much trouble. What is it, Miyabi? Tell me. Anything I can do to help. Would you mind sharing some of your soy primo sauce? Your homemade recipe. Oh, secret sauce. Not just any sauce. Like I said, Miyabi's making that signature spicy sriracha mayo, homemade style. My sauce is going to feature. This just keeps getting better and better. Theo. Let me know if I said that wrong. Hello. Please. Take as much as you need. I'm taking the sauce. I'm sure it'll be enough. But if by any chance you run out, just swing by again. The sauce is the boss. <laughs> okay. Boxy soy primo sauce. Sweet. Romero absolutely loves that sauce. I've got jars full of the stuff. <laughs> oh, you Fiona. Ooh, like the Xenoblade character. Soy primo. Doesn't that mean in Spanish mean like I am the first? <laughs> or does that mean isn't primo cousin? I thought I thought primo was cousin. Doesn't soy primo mean I am cousin? <laughs> I don't know. I haven't taken Spanish in years. Thank you so much. <laughs> You're getting awfully worked up about all this. Hey, she's excited. She wants to say thank you to everybody. He's doing a good deed. Just relax and enjoy the experience. Yes, ma'am. Ooh. Yes, ma'am. Guys, I think I'm sensing a thought behind those eyes. I think no longer. She is she has no thoughts. I think I think a neuron's been activated in there. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> she for gore. <laughs> she for gore. Now, what did I just say? <laughs> I hope everyone's getting along. All right. Now we got to go find Manana's tasty treat, right? Neuron burnt out. Yeah. <laughs> we got to go find... Wait, um, where am I going? Okay, I can hop down. We need to go find Manana's tasty treat. But Manana wanted all these fancy ingredients when she doesn't realize that it's all about the love you put into it. But Mia, but, but, but Manana does have a fancy new pot. So what are we going to do about that? Kitchen time. Great. That should be the last of Miyabi's ingredients. Oh. Yes, I think so. Thank you. Now for Manana's. Mm, what was on the list again? Uh, like... Like... Six pounds of filet mignon or something. I don't know what it was. Was mottled marble Aries meat? Killjoy crusted meat? Cozy rogel egg gems and lucky marin thick cuts. So basically an entire, like, roast beast. <laughs> like I said, six pounds of filet mignon. Easy. Nothing wrong. Easy. That'll be easy to get. Might be a bit tricksy for friends, but Manana have confidence. Man, screw you. I don't want to get your food. I want to help my girl Miyabi. All right, fine. I'll go get your food. I'm getting a little psyched for this. Ooh. <laughs> Me too. I'm going to go get some uh, tasty treats. Okay, so. Okay. This is going to be. This is, I don't want to say this is going to be difficult. Because it's not going to be difficult. It's just going to take a while. <laughs> Okay, so Pendulous Region Fold. There's something right here. Let's go. I want to see what Miyabi cooks up. What was she cooking? I want to see what she cooks up. What am I doing? A fetch quest? I'm doing... I'm collecting ingredients for a tasty treat to be made. Yes. I am collecting tasty snacks. Because 
because I didn't collect them earlier. Climb with me. What's your question? Ascension quest do you still have left? Oh! Dino Beast! Oh, Ricky no like Dino Beast! <laughs> Anytime I see any bird enemy. Oh, Dino Beast! <laughs> this party is huge. Yeah, there's seven people in a party. In this game. Oh! Dino Beast, Ricky! Uh, I think... Here, I'll read them off to you. I have a list. Uh, here's the list. I have... Huh? Fiona, Alexandria, Monica, Gondor, Ashira, Sigira, Sig Sigira, Sigiri, and that's pretty much it. And Duckweed. So about a couple. I'm a little over halfway done with Ascension Quest right now. We gotta, we're, we're getting there. Are you guys, are any of you gonna watch the Game Awards tomorrow? Because I am ready for the chain attack theme to interrupt the other themes during the Game Awards orchestra. <laughs> it's gonna happen. I'm, I'm calling it. We were thinking about doing a Shira's quest tonight. We decided against it because it would have taken too long. But we will within prob- Ah! Oh! Ah! Santa! No! <laughs> Boo! <laughs> Santa took one to the dome piece. Okay. Santa got- Blasting off again. T Santa got Team Rocket blasting off again. Okay, well that was rough. Okay, well I guess we'll fight these guys again because that <laughs> that happened, I guess. Uh oh, I think they just gave me the side eye. Um, yeah, probably in the next week I'll do. I'm looking to get done a lot of quests because I'm gonna be streaming a little bit more often. Why am I being targeted right now? I don't like this. Are we all targeting the same one? Focus tag, focus tag. Oh god, blow down! That's what blew me off the edge last time. Okay. We got him. I think. I think we'll be fine. We just got blown off last time. Falling off is very funny, especially because they hold their pose as they fall down in this game. Also, Tomir, hello. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right, so I'm not. If I'm not, let me know. But hi. We're doing Miyabi quest. It's a it's a certified Miyabi moment. Hit it, Senna. Hit it, Senna. Oh, yeah. It's a made-up name. Well, so is mine. You think my actual name's Nicolini? I assure you, I'm not a noodle. <laughs> as much as I would love to be a noodle, sadly, I am a boy. You hear that, chat? Nico wants something a bit meatier. Okay, we got the cozy rogal egg gems. <laughs> and now we need to go to the Fornus region to get whatever this is over here. I Nickel Noodle. <laughs> I Noodle I5. No. I'm sure I'll like all of them. I, there hasn't been a quest I've done that I didn't like. I will say that my least favorite Ascension quest so far is definitely Valdi, but I, that's mainly because I feel like nothing happened in it. <laughs> nothing really against Valdi himself. Gotta go against the flow. I'm a pastry. I'm a sweet treat, I'll have you know. I like this theme. This is Danic Desert, right? Yeah, I like this theme. This is a good one.
Maro King Marin. Prepare your booty cheeks. Are we going? Okay, let's go. Okay, let's just set up fast recharge. Regenerate, because why not? Is Tyon my signifier? I think Tyon is my signifier, yeah. <laughs> Nico tree? Yeah, I, I have become a... My true form is actually a tree. I'll pull it up for you guys in a second. <laughs> for those of you that are unfamiliar. My true of my true... I need... It's Trico. <laughs> actually. Nico is only my alias. Alexandria's Ascension Quest was great, but I'm biased for Lanzas. I've done all the main party. So... Which are live on my YouTube channel, if you guys are curious and or want to see my reaction soon. Senna's, Senna's quest was probably my favorite, to be honest. Had very little to do with Senna, but uh, I enjoyed it. If you guys didn't know or are new to my channel, I post YouTube videos of all my um, Xenoblade playthroughs. Or I have posted videos on my Xenoblade playthrough on my YouTube channel. And I'm also working on posting videos of all the Ascension quests. All we have left is the Ascension Quest at this point. I did all the Hero Quests, and now we're just going down the list. You did help. You did help, Oiler. Good job. It is, I, it is in, insane how much effort it took to e edit some of the main chapter videos. Like, I, I would literally be working for three days straight on one video. And I'd edit for like six hours a day. I'm the girl with the gall. Okay. <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me pull up Trico. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Trico. Let's go get him. Hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. I hope you guys are on the edge of your seat. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Do I have him saved? Oh! I found him. <laughs> I found him. I was gonna say I better have him saved. Behold. <laughs> My true form. <laughs> Trico the Pokemon or the Guardian? No, the Nico. <laughs> Very different. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of him. <laughs> That's actually my true form, you guys. Just see if you're wondering. Um, me with Chapter 7 taking two weeks. Yeah, Chapter 7 took like two weeks to edit, and we were both working on that, Ollie. We both participated in that, and it still took that long to edit, just because I we wanted it done really well. <laughs> um, uh, let's go to the other region. Is it the ATF region? Wait, where? Is there nothing here? Wait, huh? Destination map? Ah! Okay, cool. Oh, it was in the upper region. Okay. I thought you were an AI. I'm not, I am a... I, that's true. I am an artificial intelligence. I'm not real, you guys. I am an artificial intelligence created by Jeff Bezos. To siphon the money out of your wallet. For your entertainment, give it to me. <laughs> I exist solely for the purpose of my corporate overlords. <laughs> Hello, Ares. Hello, Ares. Get over here. Focus target. Focus target. Why are they all targeting me? I don't like this. You can't be both a tree and an AI. What if I was a tree created by AI? Then it works. You despise Capricorn people? Wait, why? I don't dislike it. I just think it's really small. It's a very weirdly small area. Uh, 
This feels empty. Yeah. There isn't a ton besides the giant tower in the sky. <laughs> Over there. I agree. But I don't dislike it. I don't, I don't dislike it, yeah. Have you guys seen the videos Nino Blade Chronicles 3 music be like? <laughs> Where Donkey Kong is just absolutely grooving to this theme? <laughs> oh yeah, Senna. Play us a tasty lick. Okay, real quick, let's just take a quick intermission, you guys. Because I really like this. This video, and it's short. Quick intermission. The Xenoblade 3, 3 OST experience. Here we go. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! <laughs> He's about to hit it. Hit it! I don't even know how he does that. <laughs> He's got moves. I like how the lifesaver had like, <coughs> it's like, <coughs> it's like a really shitty Photoshop of it. <laughs> Goes hard. This is the hard, by the way, real quick. This is the hardest shot in the history of SpongeBob. Like this is just, this is just tough. The SpongeBob movie is unironically one of my favorite movies of all time. Hey, yo. <laughs> National Wamba Remembrance Day. It's been an honor, soldier. It's Mwamba time. Mwamba will be missed. Rest in peace, Mwamba. <laughs> I don't think this is the video I actually meant to look up, but <laughs> I still like it. <laughs> <laughs> Start levitating. Let's go. <laughs> Zephyr dodge taking Mobius. Yoinky splunky. <laughs> Oh, no, no, I can't do this song. I can't do this song. It's too much for me. Even now, it's too much for me. I, I, I can't do it. I can't do it. Okay, I don't. That was not the video I was thinking of. I think this is the one I was thinking of. Yeah, this is the one I was thinking of. <laughs> Oh, 
This is the one with Donkey Kong in it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Why is it Skyrim? Goes hard. Oh yeah, Tom. Play those keys, boy. <laughs> there he goes! Look at him go! Is this from Shrek? <laughs> Absolutely beautiful video. <laughs> One of my favorite videos. SpongeBob. <laughs> I love that video. Okay, let's keep going. I don't want to be streaming too late, like I said. Okay. Uh, we need to go to the Cadencia region now. Okay, what do we got in here? A little tasty treat. Well, Miyabi's cooking up something dubious. Most Miyabi's cooking up some Miyabi Wasabi. And I'm very curious to see how that turns out for her. Oh. Huh? Get up. No, I don't need a face full of uni booty. Camera, please. Gawar Crust Tip. Oh, the friends. No, focus target, focus target. Come over here. Give everyone regenerate. Not that we're gonna lose, but you know. Oh, I'm kind of dying. Yeah, we should be fine. Okay, so we have to get all these ingredients from Manana, right? Oh, I or I just used my. Oh, never mind. We have. Oh, we have Miami in our party right now. Okay, yeah, I was gonna be like, dang it, I just used my burst start. But we have another one. So it's fine. Okay, got that guy. We got the meat. I could just run away right now. Or I could go full yippee mode and chain attack these bozos. <laughs> Either or. Get out of here. Did they just explode? Damn, they, just all, they all just exploded. Okay. Uh, back to the city, I think. I think. Yes. Nico, man, it's been fun, but it's been... Wait, Nico, man, it's been real. It's been fun. It's been real fun. But I've got finals tomorrow, so I gotta go to bed. Hey, good luck. Uh, I wish you the that safest of travels. Hungry. We're gonna do um, Ashira's... Uh, quest. That's the one you said you wanted to see probably next week, early next week, if you're interested. Thank you for watching, though. I appreciate it. Now we need to go cook a Miyabi tasty treat, right, Senna? Yeah, good luck on finals as well. I don't have finals, because I graduated in, like, last spring. I'm so old and crusty. Can you guys see the crust forming on my face right now? <laughs> I'm so crusty. Hungry? I'm very hungry. Okay, 
Manana's gonna cook up her tasty treat. What is it, Manana? What is it, Manana? That's all of the ingredients for the both of them. Tippy toppy job. <laughs> of course. As a, as opposed to bitty bottom job. Got everything you need now. Then I think it's about time to start the contest. The contest. Is everyone ready? The Great British Bake Off. I'm ready. All right, Miyabi. Miyabi is going to cook something dubious. Looks like both the chefs and the judges are ready. Ooh, who's the judges? Well, ladies and gents, it's time to start another annual cook-off. Let's go, Travis. And who else to narrate the events as they unfold but the city's number one charmer? Oh, Monica, no. <laughs> Just kidding, it's me, Travis, your ever affable lost numbers left. Just head. kidding, it's me. <laughs> Let's start by introducing our expert panel of judges. The lucky four adjudicators for this year's incredible turnout are... Who? Drum roll, please. Oh, I see the doctor over there. The guy who's like, who wants to know how babies are made? <laughs> Gondor! God. You've been to be a oh, no. Now. Oh, like no. <laughs> Gondor's a judge? She's gonna curse us out after one bite. Oi! Don't you bloody patronize me. <laughs> You'll be laughing on the other side of your face if you're not careful. Okay, well, let's hope she doesn't get violent. <clears throat> Moving swiftly on... You fancy yourself an avid foodie? Well, let's see how you measure up to the wise and erudite Well Well. Well Well. Bro, he's got an abacus on his back. <laughs> and he's got the... Like, how can you wear those glasses and not be a wise man? Next up, a lover of music and all things <laughs> lyrical, it's Mr. Boomer. Xenoblade, I love you. You couldn't have come up with a better name than Mr. Boomer. <laughs> For the old guy. You couldn't have come up with anything better than Mr. Boomer. He's got a refined palate for music and food, and I'm sure he's about to give us a piece of his mind. He is Boomer, you're right. Hey, Nico meet and greet. I told you guys, we're having a, a meet and greet in Bussy, Iowa. <laughs> you guys didn't know I live in Iowa. <laughs> and there's a locate there's a town in Iowa. <laughs> called Bussy. And so guys, here's my here's my merch. Guys, uh nicolini.store.com. Here's my merch. You guys would buy it, right? <laughs> this is an actual place, by the way. I'm not even joking. <laughs> I hear the nightlife there is popping. Okay. Last but not least, the child of our youngest judge on the record. The child. Introducing San. As far as I can tell, he just plain enjoys food. He'll eat whatever <laughs> you can throw at him. You and me both, buddy. <laughs> yeah, give me all your food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give me all your food. <laughs> the, the line delivery. <laughs> yeah, give me all your food. We want you four to judge the meals on their own merits as honestly as possible. Okay, don't worry, Travis. It'll be an e it'll be a fair fight. Now, let's introduce our chefs. First up's our lost numbers ace cook, Nissik. Boo, Nissik. Nobody likes Nissik. Boo. So, how are you feeling? Think you've got the potential to be numero uno? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <sighs> <laughs> Bro, he is. He looks like the um, he looks like the cat in that one video where the lady's like, "You're scaring me. <laughs> You're scaring me. <laughs> Stop being ratchet." <laughs> Stop being ratchet, Gondor. Watch it, you. No intimidating the judges. You're gonna scare the kid. You're scaring me. <laughs> Stop being ratchet, Nissik. You wanna settle the score? You do it with food. K 
calm and peaceful life. Mm, yes, indeed. Boo, Nisik. Next up, it's our very own boss. Or should that be Elder? Uh, oh, uh, let's just say uh, Madam Monica. You know what, Monica? I like you more than Nisik, but boo for the purpose of the for the purpose of this contest. Ooh, boo, Monica, get out of here. Hiss. Boo. Yucky. Miyabi sweet. Just stick to the usual. Who's next? All right, boss, it is. <laughs> next, we have Uro Boris's very own queen of cuisine, Manana. She is the queen of cuisine. She is the Gordon Ramsay of this realm. You know what, Manana? I like you. But for the purpose of this side quest, Bo, Bo, Sticky, no punk, get out of here! Yuck, gross, get out of here! You, uh, you can't have my stomach, Manana. That's for me and me alone. And whispers on the grapevine tell me our last contestant is a rising star. Miyabi moment. She's everyone's sweetheart, Miss Miyabi. Oh my god, Miyabi! I'm your biggest fan! Miyabi! Woo! I'm the I'm the president of the I'm the president of the Miyabi fan club. <laughs> you go, girl. <laughs> Let's go, Boxy. Ooh. <laughs> and those are our four entrants for today. Ooh. Shall we get started? Light work for Miyabi. If you'd like to reveal the meal. This is light work for Miyabi. Okay? She made that Miyabi wasabi gonna clean house. Feast your eyes on this. Bro, you look devilish. So cool. <laughs> the blue lobster? <laughs> You guys know that meme with the blue lobster, he arrives? <laughs> Do any of you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Here. <laughs> blue lobster meme compilation. Okay, well this is all we got. I'm just gonna let this play. Here we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nisik be like. Is it? I'm scared. I'm actually really scared right now. What's gonna happen? <laughs> Green or blue. <laughs> okay. Love that. Now you guys know what I'm talking about, so I don't sound insane. <laughs> <laughs> okay, continuing on. Well, well, well. Did well, well just say well, well, well? <laughs> Applying heat cause emergence of emerald green undertones. Or it's a blue lobster, well, well. Shell gradually transluce as it shine with beryl blades. Behold, the jade lobster. The jade lobster. You mean the blue lobster, he appears. Is this thing edible? What do you mean is it edible? It looks delicious. Actually, if you guys didn't know, I'm actually allergic to shellfish. So I cannot eat lobster. <laughs> so it actually looks repulsive. And that's why Nisik loses this competition. Because he made a dish that doesn't appeal to the masses. Because I'm the masses. Mmm. This is pretty tasty and juicy. Ooh, yummy, yummy. Contrary to expectation, taste pop and lock inside mouth. Big bang of umami fill entire taste buds. All 9,000 taste buds. <laughs> <laughs> Boomer, what are you thinking right now? <laughs> Boomer, what? Oh, he's not done. <laughs> Boomer, what are you thinking about right now? I don't get it. Just put the whole thing in your mouth. Maybe Nisik would be kind enough to assist. A 
beg your pardon? <laughs> Let's check in with our next culinary combatant. Okay, what did Monica make? It's our very own boss. <laughs> I'll find a chink in your armor. No way. My dish is the Monicurry special. The Monicurry. Oh, come on. <laughs> Rose got roasted weenies on there. How's that fair? Why? What's wrong with that? That looks kind of tasty, honestly. Oh, it's got tasty sausages in it. Tasty sausages are Napon's favorite treat? Oh, Well Well's going to love this. Well, well, well. <laughs> well, well only heard rumors. But Monicurry said to be legendary meal among lost numbers. How many times is he going to say well before the end of this quest? I'll have me some of that. Let's go, Jansen. Ooh. Oh, damn you, bitch queen. You got the spice in a spot on. <laughs> you bitch queen. Tasty treat. Look at her. There's too much flavor going on. Has Boomer said a word this quest, or is he just making noises? Awesome, awesome Boomer noises. Mp3. These vegetables, flavor, normally distinctive yet subtly veiled here, and spiciness perfectly compensate. Ooh. But despite this, single plate appear positively heaped with nutrition. Is dish spice renowned? Oh. Or something deeper. It holds a secret. It's making my tongue all prickly. Are you allergic? <laughs> Oops. Guess the kids' taste buds weren't quite prepared for that just yet. <laughs> Too spicy for the little boy. Funny. Everyone normally loves the stuff. Did I add too much lucky spice? You added too much uh, cayenne pepper. That stuff is... You gotta get the, the right amount of that. I'm sure your bellies are gradually getting rounder, but there's plenty more where that came from. Manana, manana moment. The next contender is Manana. Manana. Finally, time for big moment. Delicious dish of manana is. What did she make? Did she make like just a, like a platter of meat? A secret recipe of Napon passed down in greatest of. <laughs> <laughs> or rather, little spin on traditional version. I love the greatest of stealthy. Doodle noodles, banana style. Holy oh, moly. Holy moly. That looks like a tasty treat that can't be beat. I'm not going to lie. Okay, banana might clean house here. I'm really rooting for Miyabi, the underdog. I'm rooting for the Mi I'm rooting for Miyabi wasabi, but that looks really good. <laughs> Awesome. Whoa! That's gonna be a banger! <laughs> a banger. Thank you, Gondor. Tears of well well might form small pool. <laughs> to think Nopon exist that could recreate recipe <laughs> of legend. The ancient Nopon legend. Oh. <laughs> Riku's like, oh. Oh. <laughs> Riku is pogging right now. <laughs> He's not done. <laughs> He's not done yet. I'm gonna wait. <laughs> okay. Pog tasty. What do you think they told him in like the booth when they were recording lines for this? They're like, yeah, we hired you. We know you like practiced for probably years to get this role as a voice actor. We just need you to like moan and grunt into the microphone. And he's probably like, what game? What kind of game am I auditioning for? What kind of game did I get working? Mm hmm. Um, nom 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 nom. Give me more of this meat. More, more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I like Boomer. Boomer's my favorite so far. Well, well, never dream of chance to eat perfect doodle noodles in lifetime. Taste is 
Beyond compare. <laughs> and he's crying. Such level of extravagant. Well, well, good, well. Rocket in disguise above. Look at QBB behind him. QBB's like, I want some. Save some for me. How the prep is this so good? <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's a, it's massive too. How is that bowl so big? All right, Miyabi, you got some fierce competition. Oh, the competition's fierce, but we've got one more dish lined up for you all. Do not count Miyabi out. Do not call it a comeback. No one call it a comeback. But you're about to have your minds blown. Take it away, Miyabi. Okay. Here's the meal I'll be presenting today. What is it? Oh. Very simple. <laughs> Boomer. Oh. Oh. Uh, it doesn't look very special. Yeah, but it, I, I bet it's tasty. I guess when you put it alongside the others, yeah. Oh, you're about to you're in for a surprise, Gondor. But it clearly made with love. Preparation of dish reflect nature of chef, and this no exception. Yeah, tasty miyabi treat. Pretty. Comforting. It's like a homemade meal. It's like the it's kind of it's the kind of meal grandma would make for you. Mm, so understated, yet so palatable. Hard to express in words. Like warmth filling entire body. It's just that kind of feel good food. That kind of food you can't make for yourself. And when you have it, you're like, oh. I eat this fish all the time, but I don't think it's ever been this tasty before. Gosh, I wonder how she prepared it. I'd love to know. <laughs> Boxy's like, a little secret sauce that... Uh, Boxy's like, a little secret sauce from yours truly. See, where do we go and ask her once the contest's over? Oh. May, you have the best ideas. <laughs> now that looks scrumptious. They look like they're loving the soy primo sauce too. Ooh, soy primo. Hmm. <laughs> Boomer out here with the tunes. He's giving us dinner and a show. Oh, he's done. He didn't go for very long that time. Those were the first words he said all stream. Or, those, are the, those are the first words he said all quest. <laughs> Look at her, Miyabi's happy. All right, is it time for an actual cutscene? <gasps> now, nope. I hate to break it to you folks, but it's time for the judges to make their decision. Uh -oh. <laughs> please, 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 Jesus. Please, Miyabi. Please. <laughs> Which of these four <laughs> outstanding meals <laughs> has satisfied their stomachs? I'm sure you're all on the edge of your seats. Oh, I'm on the edge of my seat. If you could see my seat right now, it's on the edge. The winner of this year's cooking contest is... Please! Please, Miyabi! Please, I'm president of the fan club! This will be so good for my reputation, please! Please! Ooh. Ooh. God, but Manana's so talented. Tasty food. Tasty treat can't be beat. Okay, how did Manana whip up like five of those? That's a lot of ingredients. She really did need six pounds of filet mignon. Manana. Oh no, I thought they were going to say Miyabi. Why did Miyabi not win? It was supposed to be Miyabi moment. <laughs> Feels good at top. Miyabi moment. Better look next time, Miyabi. Hey, she did good. Okay, she created a tasty treat. Thanks, everyone. You all helped me so much. I didn't make pho 
worst place, but I'm glad everyone got the chance to try my food. Manana was kind enough to raise the idea. Yeah. Thank you, Manana. Huh? Not to mention. Manana's just happy that she got the the tasty award. Would be terrible shame for friends to miss out on delicious nom noms of Miyabi. <laughs> yeah. I'll have you know, Miyabi made at least one nom, perhaps two. Nisik looks in a right mood. <laughs> he looks grumpy. He looks devilish. He looks like that cat. He really does. I can hear you. <laughs> Can't let him get away with this, though, can we? We'll lend you a hand next time. Teamwork. Hmm. How'd you like the moniker, eh, Gondor? She liked it. But why are you asking me? Same as you always make it. The name dumb though. Can you come up with something better? What is this song playing right now? I, th I feel like I've never heard it. I feel like I've never heard this song play in the game. Except for like right now. You say that every time. I don't see the problem personally. I actually kind of like it. What the money curry? I'm not asking your opinion. I'm saying it's freaking embarrassing. Hey, don't be mean to your mummy. She made the mana curry with love. I've still got some left, by the way. You want a bowl or not? Yes. Yes, Monica, I want a bowl. Don't change the subject. And of course I want a bowl. <laughs> oh, I love that. Some of the line readings in this game are great. Of course I want a bowl. I hate you, you bitch queen. You and your monocurry. Of course I want a bowl. <laughs> oh, that contest was so much fun. Maximum agree. Plus this <laughs> big learning experience. Maximum agree. I can see Manana need to greatly expand the repertoire. Yes. Ah, if that's your plan, would you mind teaching me some more about cooking? Oh, yes. Miyabi, the next apprentice of Gordon Ramsay. The Gordon Ramsay of Ionios teaches Miyabi. Doc! Oh! What's up, Doc? Eh, what's up, Doc? Eh. <laughs> what's up? Christmas rally. I'm hogging right now. Thank you for the raid. Mama? Even though Miyabi already plenty good at cooking. Miyabi? There is a single thought behind those eyes. And it is tasty treat. It is happy. Oh, you're fine. Doc, it don't matter. I appreciate it. <laughs> that you'd say so yeah me i did good but i really don't have a lot of experience i'd love it if you could teach me some more oh, then let manana pick up what me i be putting down Ooh, this is a very wholesome quest nothing really crazy is happening kind of just nice me i be asking to become apprentice of manana it's very low-key i like it that's right if it's not a problem no problem! Manana, <laughs> welcome with open wings! Riku's like, I thought I was your apprentice! <laughs> Get out of here, Riku! It's, been, it's the Manana Miyabi party now. Oh, that's wonderful! Thank you, Manana! Ah, before Manana forget, I should snaffle up recipes of Monica and Nisik while still have chance! <laughs> oh, good Mana idea. curry! Let's yeah, go get, go get the recipes for some, for some Mana curry. And some blue lobster. <laughs> hey, Miyabi. Miyabi. You did great. Oh, there. we we do get Your an actual cutscene. Amazing. Good job, Miyabi. <sighs> Look at her; she's happy. I said before that I did this for the city. Of course, they were the highest priority in my mind. 
But really, it was for the both of you. I so wanted you to try it. Oh, that's sweet. It was for us? This world, it's filled with nothing but tragedy and hardship for us. But now, after coming here, that feels like a distant dream. Like they said, this competition is like a break from all the war going on. Yeah, that's right. You've always kept my wishes in your heart, haven't you? That's why you brought me here, right? Yeah. They give you a second chance. Because we're alive. We get to see these sights. Thank you. I like Miyabi. No, Miyabi. Thank you. Very wholesome, very low-key Ascension quest. I like that. That was fun. No, like I said, nothing really happened that crazy. But I just like the mild expansion we get on these characters. Glory song, Miyabi, Troubadour. The hero's class has increased to level 20. Miyabi, level 20. Bog, 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 bog. Always nice to have more friends. Bog, 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 bog. Senna, Troubadour. Bog, 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 bog. Bug, 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 bug. <laughs> I hope everyone's getting along. Wait, you're still here? Fiona. Oh, wait, did you ch you change your name? Did you change your name? Am I am I am I am I smoking? <laughs> Couldn't sleep. Name change. Miyabi moment. Well, that was nice. That was a fun quest. Well, you guys. Great Nico stream. I want to go edit because I want to get a video out by Friday. Thank you all for being here. It was very fun. I enjoyed this. So, uh, every time I go live, I'm like, what the what the hell am I going to talk about on streams tonight? And then I just ramble for how long have I been live? Three and a half hours? Three hours and five minutes? I ramble for three hours and five minutes. And at the end of it all, I'm pogging. Gordon Ramsay stream. Indeed. We were, we were cooking up something in the studio. What was he cooking? <laughs> If you guys would like to stick around for a raid, I would appreciate that. Otherwise, I will see you in the next stream, which will be tomorrow, because we're, we're going to stream the Game Awards, and I'm going to pog the whole time over every game announcement. Definitely not over every game announcement. But we're going to raid Pichu. He's playing Splatoon, and he's live. Thank you all for being here. Thank you for coming to my Twitch interactive live stream experience. I'll be live tomorrow. Okay. Good night. Guys, I have to kiss each of you good night. Centurial. Mwah. Doc. Mwah. Fiona. Mwah. Euler. You don't get a kiss. You're stinky. I'm just kidding. Mwah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Game Awards start at like 6 for me. So it's going to be an early stream. So if you'd like to watch them with me, that's what we're doing tomorrow. Thank you all for being here. New video just got posted on my YouTube today. Go watch it or I'll come get you at 3 a.m. tonight. Um, um, also, new video on Friday. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Can you get a kiss goodnight? That's for you, Free Sizzle. <laughs> Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.